bruh. Uh. Okay, let me know if if anybody is still here because that was very unfortunate what just happened. So I had clicked on a very specific output. I didn't mean the stream to everything. So I hit, so I was already streaming, but then I hit stream all. So it started broadcasting me on kick YouTube everywhere else too. So it shut down the stream for a minute. I'm like, ah, oh, shit. And then OBS crashed. But yeah, we back. What up, Pop? Poppy. Did y'all not hear me before? What up, Pasui? Can you hear me? I wonder if you hear me. I wonder if you see me too. Damn, I got short. All right, there we go. Oh, I was muted before, so that's why. Okay, I was wondering why. I'm like, damn, I guess we just won't have one of them silent streams until like an hour in when people get home from work or something. Or from school, I should say. Yeah, what's going on? What's what? What is what is it? How y'all doing, everybody? It is your boy here, and we are uh, about to pretty much make some more progress. So off camera, off camera, not off camera, but uh, last time we we unlocked a really good like uh, mechanic mechanic that basically boost a weapon's attack to the max uh capability like uh, if it's like a, a raw magic stick it maxes out the magic the 25 if it's a raw physical it maxes it out to 25 as well but if it's a mix i think it's 2010 or 1020. no i wasn't afk i was there talking i was also eating and I guess uh, I was just being dumb, not to realize I was muted. It was weird because I, I thought I had unmuted myself. <laughs> then again, OBS did crash, so there, there's that. Anyway, we got three more of these Febrite abilities or ores. I got three Febrite ores, and I don't know which ones to use them on right now. Typically, I think I'm just going to throw it on something... This is five. This is seven. What if it's already maxed? What does it do to something that's already maxed? Probably nothing, right? Vegetable, what up? Bandit's hand axe might be useful. Mason's hammer. See, this Mason's hammer would actually get super, super useful. Ah, uh, that hit rate kind of ass, though. I don't think you really need the Mason's Hammer because the classes that generally use this can normally power up off of a passive to make their uh, attack stronger. And then they have another ability on their um, AP, their active points, where they can kill and get another, uh, get another AP point. I'm the one main boss behind and then I'll be joining you and I'll be on damn. It's crazy. I feel like multi, I feel like I've been going at this game pretty slow, but I've been playing it a lot. So the fact that I feel like you, I feel like you should have been ahead of me. I feel like I should have beat this game already. I spent like hours on this game already, dude. And I already know you got like some crazy ass units over there, Motai. Mm hmm. I was thinking about just making one unit and just just 
beating everything just going through the game with one unit but it's kind of fun to just to balance the whole party balancing the party and just taking on challenges yeah it's fun what up atm how's it going bro i've been enjoying the strats been trying to catch up with the vods yeah i've been kind of going ham in this game still didn't beat it yet well i'm doing pretty good today i just was able to sit down and work on um some persona 3 uh reload uh, stuff i was working on the opening for it it's not gonna be super fantastic but i just want to have something have have some kind of presentation appeal to that playthrough so i'm doing pretty good Oh yeah, like Albion's the place for angels. Like they give you, man, the angels are way like overtuned, I guess, as it should be, since they're like, I guess the the race lore wise is like probably gonna be more divine and stronger. Just strength based wise, they're gonna be like probably stronger than humans and all that. But um, yeah, the angels are like insane defensive the defensive angels the offensive offensive angels they're just super strong oh yeah the persona 5 royal playthrough i think that was like my peak editing years peak edits because i was even like for royal i was doing a whole bunch of extra shit just to help people follow along the, the playthrough Have you set a team for online battles in the air arena? I wanted to try fighting some of your teams. I have not. I have not done that yet. Yeah, I think I think I wouldn't mind doing that like after I beat the game. I think after I beat the game, I wouldn't mind doing something like that. getting ready for stellar blade and other upcoming jrpgs yeah we are definitely in god's promised land don't you want to finish this game asap yeah i don't have any plans on playing blade uh stellar blade also like I have a habit of just, I guess, doing as much as I want to do. Like I feel, I feel fucked up, but it's like as a content creator, I know I should just be getting to the next game as, as soon as possible. But I like to make sure I like do as much as I want to. If I really like the game, I'm probably gonna want to do everything. But I, I definitely, I probably will hold back on Stellar Blade. But I definitely need to go back to play i need to beat this game before the end of next week so i can get the cold rain beat that game before the end of the month or before the middle of may so i can start working on reverie and i want to have reverie finished before like i guess the game comes out in july i hope it's not june but uh, I, I definitely want to be almost done with the game when vengeance comes out because i'm playing vengeance and they keep on releasing like all this new details and how like how much like content was added into the smt5 game i'm like bro how much just how much content did they fucking add in the smt5 vengeance like they added new demons of course we already knew that and then new routes and then they keep like releasing all this information and people was like man i dude this sounds like a completely different new different new game and shit which is insane damn i feel like i paid i, I paid them 60 dollars for a demo <laughs> i'll probably get stellar blade in the future but 
Like I still like I still promised to play near for y'all and I haven't even gotten to that. I just want to be able to sit down and play games. I'm looking for the weakest. Yeah, Artini Blade might be pretty good. I might go ahead and make that like a thing. Yeah. So we upgrade. Upgrading the Artini Blade makes sense. something specifically stopping you from just sitting down and be able to play and such i mean literally just relationship shit like that's just straight up it that's all i could really say <laughs> It was just for the swords, I fucked up. Um, after I Somnium, you're gonna go back to Reverie. I'll probably end up like finishing Cold Rain and then going to Reverie. Because I want to, I want to definitely beat Reverie, and apparently Reverie isn't as long as Cold Steel Four or Three. It's one of the shortest trails games, so I'll probably do that first, and then start a visual novel aside. Um, I'll probably start Isomnium, and then we'll go on to Vengeance. Nah, this situation is not as bad as three years ago. <laughs> but it is it is a, a similar situation to where my time is definitely um, not being spent wisely. When I say that, I mean spreading spreading myself thin is definitely is causing me to lose motivation and just just not having enough time to just fucking work on projects yeah I appreciate it, ATM. Running a sword, two sword masters, a shield unit, and then crossbow and regular bull backline. The sword masters upgraded with magic sword just take out any army units, and then the sniper just take out the flyers. That's actually, hmm. Actually, that might be really what I need right now. It's probably something that would be really good because I never really found a good team for my sword masters and I never really found a good place for most of my bow users other than on team on like weird assist teams. I feel like the trails series, I like playing the trail series, but the latest trails games, they talk too much. <laughs> 
I, I feel like the reason why Trails of Cold Steel has so much dialogue is because they have so many characters and then characters from the other games are in the game and you know they gotta like provide dialogue for all your characters so everybody gotta say something even if they ain't relevant yeah but yeah we working on that bro yeah i appreciate it Less realm shit. This could be good. Basically, you get the heal, HP, physical defense, and guard rate goes up significantly. Guard is. Mm -hmm. This could be really good. I wish there is something more you could do with it. I wish you could add like PP to like weapons or something at the cost of like 10 Febrite or something. Dragon Bone Shield. This is, oh, uh, that's the spiritual successor of Fuck. I know what game it is. She she called in she called, yeah, she called in, yeah. Uh this is like I said, it's too many, too many games. It's like I'm having trouble balancing three, so like I don't think I'm really looking forward to like the rest of this year. <laughs> Cause it's just I get I get easily overwhelmed with all that. Um games I am looking forward to. Obviously Vengeance. We already played that though, but it's like I'm looking forward to actually playing the real version of that game. Um Fucking Stellar Blade is looking good. I do want to play that eventually. And I, Final Fantasy VII Rebirth, and that I probably won't be able to get a chance to play for quite a while. There's just a lot of good stuff out there right now. And this game right here, Unicorn Overlord, snuck up on me. Like, I knew it was coming out, but I didn't really think I'd like it as much like I legitimately just didn't think I liked this game as much all right you know what I'm gonna do with this last one I think this right here completely negate attacks up to three hits Guard Hunter activates an enemy's guard and attack. Okay. This is good. After a single enemy with magic, or excuse me, attack a single enemy with magic, activates after the enemy guards an attack. This is good. I'm definitely gonna give this to one of my uh one of my people. Give it to the sh ooh, is this a shaman? I actually don't know who this is for. Game doesn't really say who is it for, so I should probably look at who it's for before I upgrade it. But if it's one of those things anybody can equip, any magician user can use, that'd be great. But where is it? TBH, they don't want this. None of them really want this, to be honest. <sighs> Activates after an enemy attacks, guards an attack. 
I guess I could still give this to her, but nah, it's not worth it then. Like I would have to, the fact that you only get two mages in this game without recruiting like a, um, a mercenary because mercenaries is how you get more shit here. And I don't want to like recruit mercenaries because <laughs> you can just recruit like specific mercenaries and just raffle stump the rest of the game if you want it. Will you play Final, fin or Final Fantasy 7 Rebirth and Stellar Blade next year then? I can't really promise if I'm going to play Stellar Blade, but I know Final Fantasy 7 Rebirth is going to be played some some point at some point within the next one or two years it is stupid because it's like i realize how long it takes for me to beat most of these games and ideally i think what i'm gonna have to start doing is just skipping side quests in these games like there's so much content in these games and i used to just be the the person who would just do almost everything in the game cover everything but it doesn't seem the point, but I don't want to skip a large portion of content just to just to get to the next game. I hate I, I hate just having to play a game quickly and not enjoy it just to get to the next one. I, I feel like I would turn into an IGN or like a, a, a person who wouldn't enjoy a game because they didn't get to take time to like learn shit or invest time into the game like without feeling rushed. Oh, I'm very interested in Stellar Blade. But my wallet is saying otherwise. Hey, yo, Multi-Man. Get jacked in. I mean, for the headphones, bro. Yo, Multi-Man with a $30 donation. Maybe I'll actually get sound in this. This, this is just for the looks. What y'all don't see is the fact that this is only connected. I don't get sound out this here. So I've been bumming it. I, <laughs> I've been bumming it for like forever, bro. For like the past two months. I've been making it work. Yeah. But low key. You want to need the finish version something to be on release for some new games. Yeah. It's like sometimes when I'm like playing the game that I don't like as much as the other one, I tend to just go spend more time with the game I do like. And then by the time like I get done with that, I get back to the older game. I don't really like as much. And it's just kind of, I don't know, makes it hard to get back into, but I still like it. Like I, I still come back and try to finish it regardless. Do let me know if you require assistance. Hey, yo, what the? Grant a role of allies based on. Whoa, 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 whoa. Based. Grant's a role of allies boss based on the number of flying targets. This is specifically. Oh, this is specifically like giving to you to beat beat the angel's cheeks in this game oh that's funny <laughs> this is the counter to angels like a mug grants plus 20 accuracy plus 20 critical rate grants 20 attack bro can you dm, DM me your address i'll send you a pair of nice sennheisers that's like my old good pair. I'll I'll do that. How about this ATM? I'll hit you up. I'll hit you up after this stream. Send me send me a DM right now. If you're really trying to send a pair of old hair uh, headphones, that'll be uh, kind of good. So I'll actually hit you up. Just got to make sure you um, so I'll probably forget. So just send me a DM. Oh, there it is. <laughs> there it is. Never mind. Yeah, just remind me 
Hey, check it out, bro. Then I can just go ahead and give you that information. May the Father bless you. I hope you. Hmm. Bro, I will take a pair of GameStop. This pair right here, I know everybody jokes about GameStop, like quality, like headphones. They actually lasted like two years at this point. And um, the bass and the sound quality was pretty good. They were like, I think 15 or 20 bucks is how I got these um, before. Before I had like it was when it was xenoblade 3 right so i had got like this gamestop because i was working at gamestop at the time so i was getting a good discount so i was able to get like like a, a 40 or 50 dollar pair of headphones for like 15 or 20. but prior to that i also had like a 20 dollar pair of headphones and um sound quality on that is good but the build was just really bad they snapped pretty easily but um these lasted two years it wasn't bad do you need a headphone with a mic no i have a xlr mic that mic is still good i actually have a backup xlr mic so i'll never need another mic for a while and i even have a usb you have a USB uh, mic as a backup. I'll keep them safe. So oh, I'll be good. Actually, I don't think I like stopped at any of these areas after we beat them. Battle for Largion? Larg Largion? Largion? Like Albion, but Largion? All them angels, dude. So there's one, two, three, four targets, right? Maybe that's what we should give to somebody in the back line here. I would say instead of Warriors Medallion, we're going to give him the aerial alignment thing. So critical rate. How about the row with the most combatants? Crit rate, accuracy. Actually, giving her those buffs, I don't think it's necessary. We probably want the people in the back line to be able to do damage too. That's actually kind of crazy. It doesn't change. It doesn't change. Accuracy and attack up. I'm trying to figure out which is my favorite recruitable unit up until this point. 
Virginia is pretty cool. I just never used her up until this point. X Men '97 being hype after ever episode five. What? What about X Men '97? Okay, so uh, wing press bowl. What is this? 21 attack. Initiative and evasion. That's pretty good, I guess. I think something like that would be better on her. Because, you know, she's already flyer, flying base, so the higher her evasion, the better. More PP. The fact that she doesn't... Yeah, she's not using uh, Eagle Eye anyway, so... I'll probably give her, like... If I can... Probably just give her a lapis pendant. Yeah, this shit is kind of OD. Cause look at this. Everybody's using a lapis pendant at this point. Shining light. Da 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 da. This team is kind of fucked up. That's all I gotta say. Like, it's extremely hard to counter this team. <laughs> like, the team is very ugly. They're they're strong. They can remove debuffs and reflect damage. They're just very annoying. You just have to like whittle down their forces. This team was made to just eat your stamina, dude. team is pretty good. Virginia's team right now is actually kind of OD. Stay right there. I shall ease your pain. I'm trying to figure out why Liza is here. What's the point of Liza? As it was meant to be. Yeah, Liza. Liza is just like supplemental heals at this point. It feels like. But I also feel like she's there to help put the pressure on flyers. Yeah, that was one. That was it. <laughs> the quick dispels, bro. This team was meant to counter any like quick cast, recast, quick bullshit. Oh yeah, they they're dead. Where's my uh team with the the Oh, please. They don't dish out as much damage. I feel like a Cleese, old Cleese needs something more, dude. I think she needs her home slash to become really like OD. If I give her the parry shield, oh. I just don't understand because this character can only do so much. It's kind of annoying, but she's really good at just being obnoxious to hit. And then she can like do a lot of good damage. I wonder if she wants to prioritize backline stuff since her attacks are range. You might as well just prioritize back row. Not buffed. Hmm. 
using her just as a dodge tank yeah i feel like that's what she does better like instead of trying to make her do crazy damage who can get follow-up attacks after she attacks yeah that sounds good see that's why i have roll fear is for pursuit activates after an ally attacks that's why i was considering just giving everybody in the back like a pursuit type of thing this team also can like shining light yeah she probably needs something more she don't need to be that quick oh i can probably get rid of this dove plume now that she has evade or initiative coming from her weapon Oh yeah, OJ Simpson died. Yeah, me and my girlfriend was just talking about that. OJ Simpson. Truly an I iconic. Yeah, oh man. He, 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 he truly was iconic, I guess. You can't talk about that man without somebody and or referencing Dave Chappelle. I think Dave Chappelle kind of put him in the spotlight for a little bit. Rip OJ Simpson. Yeah. Dude was like 76. Okay. This is cool. Follow up attack a roll of enemies. Okay, a feather sword could also do it. I have to assume people would really get attacks. Pursuit is very strong now that I think about it. She's got evasion. I feel like I should just give her her other shield back. Unfettered is passive seal, guard seal. Well, you can't really get somebody if they can block everything. Okay. Or is it? I am looking for her evasion uh, shield. I think it's like. I may have upgraded it, right? It's like a heaven sworn, heaven, yeah, heaven swing or whatever. I feel like she is like really good at just being really obnoxious to hit. Nimble fighter. Oh, you know what? To make her like really good at night, I could give her the, the, to be able to use this unit at night instead of having one of these scarves. I'm going to give her shit. I think Travis has it, but it's like a, a cloak that helps you evade at night. It's like a, a cloak that you can just equip and then I don't think it's that. Nocturnal evade. And then she can keep evading. Her evade is already high as fuck, right? Evade a single hit. Grants the user that. Okay. Wait, why would she need it? She's already obnoxiously like good at evading. So it's like, hold on. That's that's kind of what's the point? There's literally no point, right?
I eventually choked in Pistorius for using my uh, Cavalier team too much and felt like restarting. Damn. Hasten to action quick. Nah. Counter attack. This, I guess I just do this. If it's during the day. Yeah, during the day. Rinse the user plus one PP during the day. Accelerate. I guess. I guess discharge is very important. I gotta give her some PP or something. I feel like what I could technically do is kind of make the magic. There's so many ways to just play this game. There's so many ways to just customize teams and whatnot. This should hold Sharpen your weapons. Blessed winds. Wait, you only get. Wait a minute. With a You're certain to hit. You only got one buff. The buff depends on how many people there are on the team. If there's more than wow. Fly. The winds blow ever stronger. Witness my strength. <laughs> this bitch is annoying to hit. <laughs> oh my goodness. I can barely stand. I'll suffer no defeat. Like, first of all, where is she at? I just realized she doesn't need accelerate. I, I don't want her with this because her attacks actually buff her too. Even if she misses, she'll actually be able to use that. So I feel like her PP should be saved specifically for discharge and her guard ability. So she's just there to just tank shit, evasion tank shit. Um, she's here to help prevent true strike people from attacking. And I feel like the only team that beats this team immediately is a team that can cleanse with like quick refresh or refresh or like a, a cleric. So if they have like at least two clerics, it's kind of problematic. So what I would actually give Rolf, hold up, what I would give Rolf is actually rapid shot and he wants to prioritize enemy presence. Like if there is pastors present, go for the one with the highest initiative, I think that's usually how it works. And I think we had another start. It activates at the start. One PP is three or more. Okay. Rinse all allies plus 20 initiative. I think that should just always be a thing. And Rolf will activate his. If there's like a, a caster present, I guess. Yeah, I know. Oh yeah, the purity field is from the uh, elven casters, right? And we still don't know what to do with that. Let's move on. Let's get our team some actual like fights in. Do let me know if you require double us. blast attacks two enemies. Relic kill activates after an ally, uh, ally is hit. Restores HP to an ally and grants HP regeneration. It's kind of okay, I suppose. I'll buy both of those. Quick cover. That's always usually okay, I guess. 
May the Father bless you. Are we beating this game today? Yeah, <laughs> we gonna find out. I hope I don't think we are, to be honest, because Guild Wars shit starts at six. And unless this game has very short cutscenes for the remainder of the game. Yeah. Low key, I'm about to start skipping this game's cutscenes because clearly I'm only here for one thing. <laughs> and that's the satisfaction, uh, the, the, the satisfaction of defeating jackasses. All right, hold on. I, I will be the first one to say that this game's story is kind of whatever, but I, I won't skip the cutscenes. Oh, nobody plays 13 Sentinels for the gameplay. You play that for the story for sure. It's like the exact opposite of this game. All right, what team do we try to pop off here with? So they got grounded units they got they also have landmines which are mad and obnoxious we also have a nighttime thing i can try to just make some money really quick this team is usually pretty good about it and then with dinah out at night yeah Well, Virginia needs to get to level 35, so I think her team needs to be out. And we need to try to get Ocleese's team to a pretty good level. Mm, I, think, I, I think I need to change the leader. Okay, I can provide range assist for allied units. Ignore terrain and trap effect. So why would I want her when I can just do this? I, not only do I get range assist, I also get to uh, fly over shit. By my divine bow, have you need of my skill? All right, let's just literally come over here. Departing at once. I saw on wings of white. Mmm, true strike bullshit. Okay. Who are they focusing on? So, true strike is happening. They're going to prioritize the scout or whatever. It's not ranged. It's a true strike, though. However, however, however. If he has a higher ability. Now they are way faster than Rolf. Rolf would probably be able to shut one down for sure. If he was a little bit faster. So what we could do is. Based on the number of flying targets. So it's based off of how many flyers I have in my team. Okay. I didn't realize that. So. Uh, front row. How about we do the back row? It's so confusing because it's like, what is it based in off? It says the number of flying targets. So it had the targets of the skill. It's confusing because. Oh, that I, I, I ah, ah. So if I turn this off, we get our turns. But he, he should be able to just do rapid order, right? Yeah. But what I could also do... How do I beat people like these idiots? 
I don't know if there's a way to prevent because their initiatives are kind of allowing them to just overtake everything. So I think what I would need to do is have like maybe shut down a scout first. This dude has two starter battles uh, abilities. I just realized that. So that's yeah, aerial alignment is kind of bad. I just realized that you never want to have more than two starter battle abilities on the same person unless you have a weird setup going. I would say for him PP if I could, but I just literally apparently can't afford it. Hearings of pursuit. Oh, you son of a bitch. It is what it is, dog. Hastened action would be okay, but I don't have PP on them. And I can't get PP because I need to buy PP. Oh my god. Alright, anyway. Rapid shot, I think, is really good. And I think... Stunning one should be okay. If he, if he, rubber shot, scout enemies present, and I guess prioritize, uh, prioritize scout. Rapid shot. Caster, I I guess this is this is just me being like over the top with deluxe, the extra layers. So basically, this one probably takes priority. And now what I want to do, I mean, this is weird because what's really stopping the, the sword guy, I assume he's stopping one and the other dude that's trying to attack gets blinded. So shining light more than likely is only blinding one. I think that's what's happening, but by putting her in the front, she's probably getting targeted, right? Inflicts blindness on the role of users. I, I, let's see what the fuck happens. I don't know what's going on. Okay, that's what we like to see. This shit is all but a short. Why did his sniping order go off? In my The end is Oh, I think I see. Damn. Come unstoppable. Fly. I see what happens. So by moving my other bow users into the front row witness my strength it prevented it prevented us from just consistently having all of our attackers get blinded i see that's what happened my strength. Greatest so keep so if i had uh the other assist the the the, the archer in the back she would have got blinded again and she wouldn't have been able to follow up with anything their eyes are on me oh wow rush good thing they were garrisoned Shall I assist you? Make ready. Yeah, that's why I'm trying to use Liza. I'm trying to use Liza more because of the smoke, the smoke bolts. Go get him. No stopping us. Damn. Nice pursuit. There we go. 
Damn. Bro, what the fuck? Allow me. So where does it I took more than like what they said I was gonna take. What the hell? How much damage did they say they were I was gonna take there? I don't think it showed. Watch what royalty can do. Have you need of my skill? I make haste. Oh my god. Bruh. How? They just got to do that infinitively? Know well the limits Bruh. That was toxic what I just witnessed. Alright. That was actually kind of fucking toxic. I'm bringing the bear into the front too. To help like mitigate damage. Bro, is it me or is the game lying? What the fuck? They're saying I got healed. I shall ease your pain. I guess she didn't have that much HP to begin with, but it's like. I know she can't just heal immediately again. What is it? What the fuck? Also, it seems like if she parries, she can't follow up. So I might need to think of a different ability. No caster enemies present. See, this was never supposed to happen. That's a low key, very annoying. Royal Guard. I tell you what. Doing something like this against a bunch of people with row attacks probably seems like the better uh, idea. I was kind of confused with how all that played out. Man. The fact that she can't do any kind of like... Yeah, her maiden's hammer shit is kind of whack, bro. I'm gonna be honest. I'm gonna do PP. You can do this like once or twice. Okay, grunts the user. Plus one PP if the attack hits. Definitely. I would say person with the lowest percentage HP. Heavy bolt. It wasn't me or did she still do? No, she did power bolt. Hawkeye, huh? One PP is two or more. Let's say three or more. All right. Let's see. Let's see how how it happens again. I've no allowance for mercy. So I'll go in the back. Go over here. Go over here. Damn, you getting cooked? Nope. All right, what are we fighting? Casters?
So if I take off, yeah, it's probably better off to just keep it. So we're losing 62, 57, 71, zero damage. You gotta love it. I wish there was a, I guess that's the one thing they don't really like give you, um, total control over is like knowing if somebody dies or not. Cause I guess it's because oh, please didn't really contribute much HP to the, the pool of HP the team unit has. They're getting multiple pursuit attacks. It's probably better to really guard. Cure the offensive. This should hold with a single strike. Yeah. Never flinch. This should hold him. My aim shall never fail me. You just gotta switch up the party sometimes. Damn, dude, they are getting mad reinforcements. Whoa. You don't stand a chance. Do you see how quick they're getting reinforcements, dude? After an enemy attacks. Okay, no caster enemies present. Iron Veil is not activating. So I wonder if I should. Actually, Iron Veil should. Okay, counterattack. Royal Guard. Dragon Bone Blade. I should probably upgrade this, huh? Her initiative is pretty bad. Is there a better sword for her? I mean, this sword would be pretty good, but it's not the best. Icefall Blade. This is way better than Bear's Den. One parry should be good enough. Well, maybe two parries. Still dies. Let the bear take the hit. It's so weird. Oh, is she still able to counterattack if she's a part of a column attack? Shall I assist you? None of you will die here. No stopping us. This might be the new formation. Bruh, Knight's pursuit is pretty toxic. So why was she still parrying, even though I told her to only do it if her AP was below a certain amount or her PP was... With my A. I might have just fucked up, I guess. Ooh, she charged it. She looked like a Smash character, bro. She said one, two, held on to the, 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 the B button. Somebody stupidly tried to, like, shield, try to sidestep it at the last second, but they got, they got scared. You defy me. Brandish and Perry should literally work hand in hand together. Perry two. I guess it needs to be three or more. He'll use Iron Veil. One Perry should be okay. Because Brandish will put her back up to another one. Listen, there's a lot of minions. Sometimes it just slips. Yeah. Pass down your magic. Yeah. 
Hold on, I think I need a third unit because this these motherfuckers are out here like Watch what Royal doing shadow clone jutsu like it's like the easiest thing in the world to them. The day will be ours. Your villainy ends here. You know. Victory grows ever closer. I gotta make sure not to blow the fuck up though. Onward. You face me. Well fought. Mm-hmm. The the go uh, the the goat team. Really. Your villainy ends here. A fine bout. Wait, she's getting EXP just by association. But that's good. You face me. I shall rain arrows upon them. And since she's on a tower, she doesn't co it doesn't cost her anything. That's good. Nah, man, you finna get some damage dealt to you. We're not finna keep doing this over and over again. My wings shall take me. Ooh, the whole team gets hit? down your mandate like how like doing reinforcements was way too quick bro kneel before me you yep, get fucked all right there we go A paltry effort. come on girl you don't stand a chance i'll let her level up is anyone surprised Okay, how how far are you from another level up? I gave her the debuff immunity, you know. Time's at hand. Oh, we get fucked? Huh. It's not because you're in the back. Oh, quick dispel. That's probably quick dispel. That's what's happening here. They got somebody that can quick dispel us. So in situations where that happens, literally don't even waste your PP. Just turn that off and it should just go to Elaine. I've arrived. We march. Yeah. That way we don't get fucked up. My wings shall take me. So what's we got a pretty a pretty crazy matchup it looks like. I won't disappoint. Yeah, this matchup is looking pretty uh beefy. I was still Lane and his team though. Damn, I need some I need I need some nuts after this. Your villainy ends here. Shall I assist you? Damn, we take 69 damage? Nah, we're just gonna leave it at that. <laughs> refresh. Shout out to refresh. Double spinning edge. Don't go down. Literally, double spinning edge because it's two double. It's, it's two spinning edges in a row. Triple double, triple double, double double, double double edge. Oh, nice dodge. Damn. I'll do what I can. I'm here to help. Don't go dying on me. Man. Be safe. Get your ass out of here. Here we go. Alright, next round should actually be theirs. Low key. But they're about to heal, so. The time is at hand. Da -da 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 -da. Have you need of my skill? God what? damn. We actually need to Our time grows short. This is actually one of the toxic maps for some reason. Damn, the assists really help out, huh? Alright, I'll I'll have it. Oh my god. Oh man. I gotta give y'all the illusion that, you know, the headphones are working fine. 
<laughs> okay, save your progress. No, I don't want to save my progress. Why did invisible people just die? <laughs> like what? Some people were invisible as hell. Do let me know if you recall. Lapis Bell activates after an enemy. Ooh, activates after an ally uses a passive skill. That has uses. May the Father bless you. Inquisitor. We could always use with more sniper eyes. Father bless you. I hope. Provisioner. Welcome to my humble store. Look around is my my thanks. Liquid fortune. My thanks. My thanks. That's the sh man. Liquid fortune was only two k there. May the father watch. They you. were hiding. They didn't look like they was hiding in plain. Like it wasn't even in like. It was on the road. It wasn't in the forest or nothing. It was just like there. It was just like they died. They died invisible. Invisibly, right? What's your favorite set of tracks? I'll find Dragon Hole Bestorius. Bestorius has some really good music. Where are we going? Nice. Is this? Oh, Feverite? Nice. Do of illusion. Is it? Uh, I think that's Albion. That's got to be considered Albion's shit, right? Story stuff over here. The battle for Roast Ford. Uh, there was actually another side quest over here. I think I, th th what was this guy's name? Jeremy or some shit? All right, so I think there was something I came to realize, right? Character list. We should give the magician something, right? He has Lapis and Carnelian, so what we could do... I guess we can give... We can take both of these away and give them an item that gives them one of each, right? And then we can give them an item that lets them, like... I gave him hasten strike though, uh, hasten cast. Wait, isn't there something that lets you do that? Oh, this way I wouldn't need to have Magia heart on him. I think I'd give it to somebody else. I give somebody hasten action. I use hasten action and then he gets to have two free slots or another free slot. Because the reason why we don't have true strike on them is because we have this setup. So Osh is in our party, Elaine is in the party. Our backup is Sharon and the Elven girl. I feel like Sharon does a lot of work for keeping us debuffed or keeping us from getting debuffed. The other girl could probably use. I think it's uh, Ridial. It's got to be her, right? Or was it the other one? He's the one in Elaine's crew. I think. No, I think there's somebody else. Who was it? I think it was Ridial. No, it's Gladimir. He has quick impetus.
so I could technically give it to your boy here. I could give him hastened action, which is a ring. I don't know, because then it's like kind of. Nighttime. What was he? His cover skills are like needed, right? But I feel like if I hasten action or something like that. Because I do. He's kind of like a backup just in case something fails. Yeah, that actually sounds way smarter just to optimize it. So let's get rid of Magia Heart. Magia. And then give them the eagle shit. Cause that'll give you, that gives you crit and you're right. It gives you crit and what's him gonna call it? Eagle eye, Hawkeye. If we give him the Hawkeye one, he gets true strike and a guaranteed crit. So yeah, I, I guess that's pretty good. Oh, that's game over then. That is literally game over. Team shouldn't lose. The only way the only way they lose is quick dispel. This is the team that gets fucked up. Back row. Caster. I think he has the highest magic attack. Now we don't have to worry about shit. Elaine should just be able to solo. Elaine's group should just solo everything. Yeah, look at this shit. There's still, I don't think there's a way to beat. There should not be a way to beat, um, Quick Dispel. You've nothing to fear. Defeat is not an option. We'll never fall. Hey. Yeah. Well, the only way to beat. Oh. oh, bro. Alvary Slayer, oh, AP and less DP. Yep. That thing active. Like, geez. Yep. That was way that 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 damage was insane. As long as they don't have magic barrier converter or quick dispel. That's the only time where that strategy just doesn't work. I think there's a way to counter quick dispel though. Look at these people over here. I'm sending oh please over there, I guess. But now we have Magia Heart available. You can't Magia Heart and recast the same person, right? Magia, 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 Magia. He's in cast. This is the start of a battle, start of battle skill. So any teams without it would probably be okay. Start a battle. I don't think we really have one. 
Hasten cover is kind of janky. We try to like bait and attack and then do hasten cover. But that also gets quick dispelled, I think, unless you follow up. Rain these units. See, I'm seriously thinking about having a caster in the back of here. There's not really a lot of other magical units other than the these people. Relinor. What's the other guy? The, the guy with the cool name, I guess. Illithian. He could use that shit. Nature's Wrath. I don't know why. Okay. I don't know if there's a magic skill you can give him. Maybe there is. It's physical. Actually, he's a caster, right? That's what it, it's only allowing him to go next. It's not like he needs magic attack, right? It's just only a caster can equip the, the heart. Hmm. Yeah, only a caster can equip it, so... I don't know why we would need him for anything. He doesn't really. He's in cast at the beginning of the fight. Press the user the ability to evade one attack, attack a row of enemies. See, if he could recast that or something, man, it'd be different, but. Actually, the combo would be if you could. If you if you could, what you would want to do is build this dude to go first immediately. And then like if you were going against like uh, Cavaliers, right? You could just have him go first and then have somebody else. It's not recast, but there's a, a Coliseum item that lets somebody else make you attack again. It's weird, but it could be worth it here. I don't know. I just wouldn't know how to like utilize it. I mean, I could probably just give her something else now. Recast. Earthquake. I'm giving her the ability to go first immediately is good. I think quick dispel. I was trying to find a team to counter quick dispel, and I thought hasten cover would actually work as well. Yeah. Evasive impetus activates after evading attack. Grants the user one AP. Yeah, yeah, that's pretty good. Especially since Mirage, Mirage Stab. Mirage Stab lets you evade one attack. That's actually pretty cool. He might be good on Ocleese's team. Oh, wait, I did. I did put him over here. Okay, um, we actually might have a use for you now. Uh, 
nighttime. All right, nighttime killer, bro. But that makes you all physical. I don't think he wants this. I think that was just put on him for something else. At the start of a battle, decent cast, right? So he can equip this. You don't need ice conferral. I would say. There's a couple of things we can do to make him like evade shit, right? We can probably give him evade just straight up, but he's, he'll be wasting two PP. He doesn't have a way to get PP back. Now, what you could do is probably make him a nighttime killer. Like you can literally let this dude become, this is what I would do. Maybe he'll be like a nighttime person, right? Nighttime only looks blindness and then give him give him Travis's ability uh, the, the cloak because you get PP you get the evade basically as long as much as you want with this nighttime that's like a very specific thing but Ace and cast would probably be like um, if a specific enemy was like posed a threat to this team. I don't know what team kind of poses a threat to this team. Arrow users, maybe. Probably no, 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 no. The, the scout people. So he would probably need to be built with some uh, initiative too. Yeah, blind cut, which makes them instantly evade attacks. Yeah. So we can put up with thieves as well. I mean, he can he can belong here, too, because they want to be evading. They want to evade as well. This is. Nighttime, nature's wrath, Calvary targets. That's the only time you want to use that. Only when Calvary people are here. I don't need that one anymore. Click stun. The enemy is not stunned. How about that? That way, if somebody else has AP or PP and they need another turn to stall, you can just stall and not waste your AP. And then once they get up, you can stun them again. Cloth. He needs something. He needs more AP or PP at this point. Clearly this dude needs something. Immediately activate one charge attack. So if somebody had really bad initiative, probably do that. I just can't think of why that would be useful right now or how to make it useful. Grants an ally PP. I gotta give somebody that. Make a row of allies. Next attack. This has got to be like a once per thing. I feel like Eagle Eye wouldn't even need to be on now. That'd just be a waste of his PP. Fuck aerial alignment. Dude, we need PP shit, bro. This is actually like, because I have so many different teams, I need more PP. Like, it's actually embarrassing. So I guess sniping order back roll.
Yeah, dude in the back. I would say not stunned, but... Lightning blade, right? With armored... I don't know about you, bro, but the fences I've played would have a tendency to one-shot people. Yeah, like, them fencers are kind of... It's mad annoying. So, like, the one way to, like, fucking ruin their lives is to have somebody really fast just stun them. And the elven sister, this girl, does a really good job at stunning, like, people at the start of a fight. But if they have clear or something, even if they have clear... It, it bypasses their like their start of battle skill because their start of battle skill will be canceled at that point they need to get healed um knight's pursuit i think so i don't know if that works like that dustbound staff magical shell is kind of whatever I can see this being really good for a shaman. Or even a healer who doesn't need like another staff. I guess the only thing I could really do for my flyer squad or for Rolf is to say fuck the bow of swiftness and give him something else. I think right now. Is banishing pursuit okay if they're buffed if they're buffed let's just say that fuck it fucking okay, magic people I would actually want this team to deal with that, I guess. But I don't think they can really deal with it. Actually, my Griffin, like Franz unit, Franz unit probably handles this. They get him. They handle these people pretty easily. Understood. They really gonna say, uh, well, fuck it. Yep, thought so. You've made the right call. We just want to get rid of the assist. I like how the wyvern came over there. Flying. How about this? Physically attacked. I, okay, so if... Eighty-five. Yeah, I could deal with that. Oh yeah, we gave him. We stole the Grand Barris. That was something I shouldn't have did. I guess I can give him magic defense. He loses his physical defense, but hey, pretty sure he doesn't die here. Yeah. No, it looks like he does die here. Well, we can we can res him. We can res him. We can probably res him. Yeah, fuck it. We can res him. I ain't I ain't worried about that. Glass cannon team would be a dark knight. Here we go. This is where we throw caution to the wind and just go in. Yeah. 
Damn. So, why does she do curing call? I did it. Dead and buried. Prioritize debuff. I guess they got debuffed at some point. I stand ready, sir. You dare challenge me? Apparently, I want to see how this plays out. Bear, 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 block, 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 block. I just know Life Blow is definitely dealing a lot of damage. With my aid. I feel like it's the main reason why we end up like. Just relax. If she was in the front, it definitely would have did more. Issue is she can never like take multiple hits man watch what royalty can do okay i'll take it off your hands there right, there we go i won't disappoint is that all no mercy yeah just clean them up The funny part about that is it was just the healer. It was just the healer. The overheals is actually pretty fucking clear to me as being really strong. Because they didn't take any damage because of uh I guess by my divine book passed down your mandate. They didn't take any damage because of the heals. We overhealed. What royalty can do. Hmm. Have you need of my skill? Yeah, just have her move up Talk over there. To be able to help. You don't stand a chance. Shall I assist you? Uh, she don't need to assist right now. Yeah, just slow and steady. Slow and steady. My wings shall take me. I make haste. Kneel before me. I shall rain arrows upon them. Goodbye. As expected. That's what we want to see. See that, Magellan? Lay down the barricades. They must be stopped at any cost. Bruh. I'm get. just going to fly over to you, bro. Nowhere is too far. Okay, who is this? Have you need of my skill? Yeah, just keep moving forward. Proceed with caution. Greater gravity. Oh my goodness. At your service. If I can get her over here, and then they can basically take Understood. the lead. As you we want her on the uh, on the uh, towers there. You don't stand a chance. Shall I assist you? Uh, sure. Ate them up. Ate them up, dude. Virginia is now like Have you need of my her group is pretty I'm good. Haste. I wish I stopped by the Coliseum first, Kneel though. Before. I shall rain arrows upon them. There we go. She's gonna need some uh You're nothing. Yep, this is easy. Easy. I would expect nothing less. Dude, Fran is OD. My duty is complete. At your service. At once. Just beat him up, dude. I must stand strong. Hmm. Oh, I, assist you? I mean, we definitely would want your boy to be alive here because it looks like he would be able to help a little bit more if he was alive. I shall rain arrows upon them. Here we go. Basically, Revive the dude that was supposed to be like, I guess. I stand ready. The defensive person. 
let's see they can come over here how much does it cost to do that the blade wave because i kind of want to just do blade wave watch what royalty can do actually it uh, instantly ends the wait time for nearby allies I don't want to use one of those, but uh, fuck it. Some camping sets are very like nowhere is too far. Rare, but at the same time, it's like I'm probably never gonna use them. So nope. I might as well just utilize the things that could help me now rather than never use them. Watch what Blade, can do. Bear crush. I'm hoping to knock all this shit out. Oh, I don't think I've ever seen that. Holy shit. I won't disappoint. Like, it even fucked up the barricades enough. That was good. That blade wave is kind of fucked up. Is anyone surprised? No, we're not. Okay. So check this out. What is it? At your service. We're just gonna light tail feather. Yeah. Even on uh the team Rainies. Team Rainies no right now. Didn't even need it, but at once. Watch what royalty can do. I'm off. Time is with us. We only keep our focus. Oh, uh, that's why they threw that out. Yeah, flyers were great for this. It seems you've misjudged me. At your service. Yeah, just keep going. Understood. Not really afraid of this jackass. Shall I assist you? No, because apparently you suck ass. No, actually, just for this matchup. They don't have any they have some javelins so i don't know i shall rain arrows upon them shall i assist you my griffin needs a rest peter griffin is too far so i stand ready rest Nowhere and then just far. use one of these lovely gold hourglasses at your service at once no mercy goodbye gg all right get ready to claim this i thought we had one more i thought the the boss was up no <laughs> oops no unique dialogue for that guy <laughs> that guy gets no screen time like i thought the boss was up north it's so Jerome. My road ends here. Is Jim and Jerome? Do with me what you will. But I beg you, see that my people live out their days in peace. Raise your head, Sir Jerome. I'd like you to brandish your lance for the liberation. Pardon? You are not a general of Zenoira. I beg but the your local pardon. Lord of a peaceful Albion city. By all accounts, you and I have no reason to fight, and much to stand together. You speak the truth, yes. But that doesn't change the fact that I swore fealty to Zenoira. One whose hands are as stained as mine could never deserve a place in your army. Perhaps, had you chosen to sully them of your own volition, I have someone here who claims quite the opposite. It's you. No matter what he says, Lord Jerome only ceded to Zenoira's demands to see his people safe. I can still recall the day they first invaded as though it were yesterday. He rode out to receive them, 
commencing negotiations in earnest before they could spill. And that was the condition. We canvassed the city as well, yet failed to find any among its people who condemn you for defecting. They all spoke with one voice of their lord's undying devotion to their well being. And every army could use a leader with such dogged dedication. So I ask you again will you join us? As if I could refuse a request so boldly impassioned. Very well. It is with great pride my lance rests with you. Is he a new class? I completely skipped any I I skipped all the battles, so he might be a new class. <laughs> I <laughs> I stressed. I, I thought the boss was up north and I was just like, all right, I'm just skip all these battles down here. I feel bad. No, I think he's just like another Joseph, right? Yeah, he's just another Joseph. Oh, he's a backup Clive. Oh, I need more gold milk. Thanks for stopping. Drop by. Hmm. Do let me know if you require assistance. Restore major HP to all allies. Grants the ability to survive one lethal blow. Uh, that costs too much money for me to actually care. Like, there's better shit. Like, that's decent, I guess. Heavy guard. Ooh, ruby pendant, sapphire pendant. May the father. Bless. Even if it makes us broke as bombs, that's worth it. We we'll eventually need a raven plume again. Elite beret. Spirit necklace. Hector activates after an ally is debuffed. Remove all debuffs from an ally. Grants the target immunity to one debuff. That's kind of good. I'm just broke as hell. Thinking about selling some of them gold eggs, but nah. What we can sell is the ores, though. I didn't even know you can sell these up until like maybe a couple streams ago when somebody mentioned it. I forget who mentioned it, but shout outs to them. You may re Welcome to my humble store. Look around as much as you please. A goat biscuit. Yeah, we need goat biscuits to go recruit certain things. Oh shit, what the fuck? Didn't expect that to happen. Who the fuck? Lamp light ring? It can't be good, right? Blind, oh, blindness immunity. Heal 10% HP when using active skill. Grants all allies plus 30 accuracy and immunity to blindness. This buff cannot be removed. Huh? 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 They, we got grand blue abilities. This buff cannot be removed. And the fact that who can equip this? Looks like anybody can. That's super good. Lamp light ring. Give that to somebody with mad ability to go fast. Anybody can use this. That's really good. So somebody's first action should probably just be that. Dude, the whole counter exists right there. Okay, so 
who should we give that to? But, uh, wait, Cat Bestral? Elheim's Hidden Treasure. What? It's buried in a place where there's a wealth of magic. Uh-oh. Treasure? You know I love me some treasure. Hold up now. You know I love me some treasure. What 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 he talking about? What he saying? Urvelda's talisman. Oh, he. It's because I'm a bona fide treasure hunter. Except for Elheim. There's a couple calluses on my feet. Wealth of magic, huh? Well then, it's definitely gonna be somewhere in this uh, typical area. A wellspring of magic. Easy. Are you thinking about what I'm thinking? Yeah, he can owe me one thing. Wait here just a moment. Ooh. Fran said <laughs> smirk. <laughs> 30 HP plus 10% HP. She just smirking. Put this on a bear with life blow, it's over. It can only be held by the Supreme Guardian of Elheim itself. In light of everything you've done for us, Elaine, I think it's only fitting that you take it as your own. I better be able to equip that on anybody and not just Elaine. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That girl should do a lot more damage now. Somebody who wants to be in the front line taking and tanking damage. So Fran immediately any the Griffin Knight Fatal Dive teams 100% immediately get a buff to how much damage they do in survivability. We can give it to Virginia. Virginia could also use it to clap back, make it easier, make her threshold for doing more damage at lower health higher. So she'll be able to use it, stay alive longer and pop back or pop off easier. Uh, where is Virginia? See, the worst thing about Virginia is if you use her at all her accessory slot is only one so you only get one slot for her and if you marry her the ring goes into her only ring slot <laughs> it's like what order acquired mm -mm -mm. I got to give it to Fran. Fran is about to just cause more problems than ever. I can do it for, I can do it for the other girl. I could even do it for big boy himself. Cause he has a life blow, right? Attack a single enemy deals damage equal to 80% of the user's HP. 80% of his HP, right? 80% <laughs> of 180 is guaranteed knocking somebody out. Like, if you were not a boss, you probably dead. You better kill this man. Dude, give him all this HP? What If I put him in a party with other, other people who benefit from having higher HP, like Bertrand wants to be in Fran's party over Bryce. Because if Bertrand is on the limited heal team, you'll be able to heal past 180. Mm -hmm. 
man. If somebody's using life share, using this would actually be really good too. Yeah, so that yeah, this this thing actually helps a lot. But there's only one, since we're using no mercenaries, right? Aside from the two mercenaries I recruited earlier, we don't count them. Um, we haven't been using mercenaries, but if you made a mercenary team of just these bears and just gave them a lot of health <laughs> and let them tank everything, dude, and let them heal, you could just life blow everything to death, bro. Like a team of five bears at the end of the fight, just killing everything. Um, with that said, with that said, Fran, so she's already getting 20 HP there. She's getting guaranteed. She doesn't technically need this, especially aerial wing, like. She only cares about Eagle Eye. She needs to have true strike, right? So realistically, I would probably want to get rid of this. If I get rid of her Carnelian Pendant, it prevents her from doing... It prevents her from being able to do... Uh, two Fatal Dives. But if I gave her a ruby, she could probably do four or she can do three fatal dives, right? Because if she starts off with four AP, does a fatal dive. Nah, she could only do it twice regardless. Unless somebody gave her AP. She needs aerial wing or excuse me. I don't think there's a way to grant somebody. Wait, hold up. There might be a shield that grants true strike. I remember there being a true strike shield, but it looks like it might only be related to. Yeah, it's it's related to somebody not using a heavy shield. Damn. Bro, 153. You definitely need this. You need this. Uh. Is there anything that gives her AP in attack or AP and HP? If there was something that gave her AP and HP, that'd be really good. Another source of AP. I mean, right now, it looks like my best bet is to give her something with AP. This would help. Like, she lose 10. No, she's actually losing 20 HP from doing this. But if I do that, then I could get rid of the Carnelian uh, uh, Pendant. Carnelian Pendant, I guess. Max HP. And might be best because if, if I can. I would have to find a way to give uh, the team. I would need to find a way to give her true strike. The rules of numbers, the more attacks we get. I think a, another way to make this team outrageously good is to remove. Ooh, I, I think I should go get elite standard now. This team could be really strong as fuck. I think if we get the elite standard thing. Oh, wait, I went to the wrong area. I thought that was the Coliseum. So if we can just make this team like negate the chances of getting hit a couple of times, that would be good too. We could just remove the, the tank. 
Don't need this because we found it in the world. Reinforce could also be really good. Initiative. Defense. Negates up to five hits. Negates up to five hits. So if I am a if I'm a three unit going against a, at least a five unit. I'm at least getting buffs one and two. But if I had only two units, what, what, what unit would pop off with only two units? Because having that third buff means you're not going to have to worry about shit realistically. Obviously, the United Front gets fucked up if you try to go for that third skill. If they have multi hit, so if they do Meteor Strike or something. You, you kind of get screwed over. But granting 30 plus initiative to everybody is kind of good, though. Yeah, stall team would actually be good. I used to have, used to have something similar to that. From the fight. Oh man, I think I am gonna buy the elite standard. Got nothing but like my other option I was gonna do was actually get this or the hero's great shield. Provoking wall is pretty cheap. Force a roll of it. By the way, this applies to everybody. It, it forces the entire field to go after the user who uses this, by the way. Cause I've seen it work on people in the back row and the front row. User will negate one physical attack. This is such a good thing to have too. I think I'm gonna get the most use out of here. Elite standard would be fun, but realistically, I think this ability I, I think the great champion the champion's tower shield is probably good united front could be uh, i could give this to gilbert's team but i would have to remove a unit because as long as he has the ability because i think he only grants 20 initiative having this would be an increase to his ability so it, it would be 30 initiatives yeah i think i'm gonna get the champion's tower shield you won't regret it you ever yeah i'm i'm gonna lock that in right now he doesn't want blind cure he wants this dude kind of was on some bullshit not gonna lie so i could technically give him this talisman as well to make him even better to, to give him some tankiness but i think in re, uh, reality we want him to do provoking wall he's always going to do that at the start of a battle Thieves would probably fuck up this strategy because they could just attack before he do, does anything, right? So... He would need passive... Passive seal or... Yeah, passive ability seal or passive immunity. Oh, shit. It's kind of hard to have to constantly do this. Passive cure. And I guess guard, uh, guard cure. Instead of blind, she realistically would want probably freeze. Freeze cure. Maybe give him something that 
prevents that shit, right? And I need to give one of either one of the girls or a tank that uh, HP. Like, I think I am going to give it to Fran. Over Wyvern. Yeah, this is going to be risky. But if I see that we're not doing as much damage, it's probably because her setup gets fucked up. Or the inability to, you know, do guaranteed hits is probably going to screw her up. So I'm going to give her more HP. But the ability to do way more damage, I think, outweighs that. So it's 50% of what her, whatever her health is, right? And after a limited heal... Hey, what up, MC Koi? Yeah, we, we, we live. We, we, we out here live. Out here watching the East 8 playthrough. Yo, East is... Coming out with a new game this year. Oh, I'm excited for that. That's for sure something I'm going to have to check out later this year. All right, so Fran's team just became indomitable. Also, what I could do now since... What's the safest thing? If they're always going to focus attacks on him, they might do column shit. Also, he needs to be in the front row for it. So what might be best at times is to do something like that. But you never want to have anybody behind him now since he has a provoking wall. They can be up front for days now. Giant great axe is giving her 20 HP. Falcom do be pushing out games quick. I'm like, damn, I thought they was a small, like, studio, right? But I guess not. They they able to keep up, apparently. Did we do this one? How do we know if we did the, the auxiliary qu uh, quest here? Cemeteries of Albion. I didn't do this one. Didn't do the other one. Illusory cloak. Is that the night cloak? I'm pretty sure it's the one I have, right? The one that should be on Travis. Oh, that. Twilight cloak. The fuck is the illusory cloak? Some of these things, some of these trials are definitely worth doing for the unique items. All right. Uh, I guess we'll just have Virginia's unit just sit on this. What royalty can do. And we're going to have Fran's unit just have fun. I think Fran's unit might be the most OP unit right now. To the skies. Nowhere is too far. Victory awaits. It's not like anybody else is going anywhere. That's exactly why that high bullshit is exactly why I have uh, a whole team just sit on top of the uh the base You're nothing nothing so they quick dispel them right but little did they know i'm here to help little did they know they needed that quick dispel for something else Seventy-eight. Like new. I see what happened. I think I 
never fixed the quick impetus strat on on her yeah so this should be front row flyer i should actually not even say uh, front row i should just say flyer yeah we we definitely should have popped off more passive miracle fuck that up Damn, who out here shooting at us, man? Understood. In the name of the liberation, nowhere is too far. No, I'm, I'm so. coming for that ass. You not shoot me again. No mercy. Put cast. Active gift. Damn, they just gave her all the abilities again. Bitch, why are you still using quick impetus on the back line? What the fuck is what? Victory is ours. Bitch, didn't I tell you to do it on flying? Prioritize flying. You dumbass. At your service. At once. Now, nah, why are y'all walking out of there? You're nothing. Y'all needed this. Oh, they can refresh the provoking wall. On <laughs> 105. Bruh. Half of 200 is how much? A lot. Sir, at your service. Uh, how do we heal faster? Standing by, I stand ready. No mercy. Goodbye. I have to catch Oh, we up. still waste stamina. Okay. What? You're nothing. Bro, MC Koi with the five. Yo, let's get it. This isn't much, but here's something for all your great content. I appreciate it. Thank you for the support. And uh good looking. What we want to do is get our Valor points up. No, we don't need to do that. Nowhere My favorite thing far. to do is the rest and service. then use a gold hourglass. Victory is ours. Best to be careful. No mercy. zero damage damn he's really just soaking up all the damage then okay so quick dispel doesn't really do anything other than get rid of his physical attack uh negate i stand ready <clears throat> at your service hold on one more disembark at your service Understood. Ooh. Is too far. I stand Ooh, now go back in it. They thought they were slick. I broke their ankles while boarding a fucking vehicle, bro. Imagine jumping out a moving vehicle. Well, never mind. But imagine jumping out of a vehicle, breaking somebody's legs, and jumping back into the goddamn vehicle, bro. Breaking their ankles, I should say. Understood. I uh oh shit. Nowhere is too far. Yeah, we wasn't making it out of there. Wait, it looks like they did. At once. I'll take it off your hands. Nowhere is too far. Understood. Virginia finna get some uh level ups. Dead and buried. Maybe service you know what's crazy i have not used hilda i have not been using her at once Best yeah we kind of want to hurry up before way. it's actually uh dark sir because that's a matchup we probably don't want to even mess with kneel before me a paltry effort 
Nowhere is too far. At once. Boom, 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 boom. Face me and be cut down. We take 23. Who takes 23? Main character? Main character Bryce? I stand ready. There we go. GG. Yeah, I'll be doing Isomnium after Rain Cold. It's just Isomnium is going to probably run alongside uh, Vengeance in June. Phantom Knight Shield. Wait, that wasn't the one I wanted. What the fuck? Okay, what was the other one? Okay, there was another. It was something with a, a cloak. I guess that one was all the way over here. Let's see. Okay, we're gonna go over here. Probably just go straight for oh soldiers, huh? Active gift. Probably gonna give it to the home slash assholes. I think Fran and her team could actually deal with these people. Like low key, so yep. Bring out Virginia's team. You've made the right call. What is it? And then bring out Actually Hodrick's team's been dying for some action here. So we're gonna say make her the leader. Make her the leader. You've need of my let devotion shine through. Is it almost I'm gonna just make it dark time. Cause I'm trying to make this go by fast, fast. Whatever I can. And then I'm gonna give her a light feather. We can buy those green blossoms at any tone uh any moment. As swift as possible. Bruh. Surprise! Yo, Monzi with the 46 subscription. The uh, 46 months. Thank you very much. Road protection. Alright, we're getting clipped by arrows, right? So that means old girl in the back might be dying. But not today. What are you doing? Go get him. This dude active gift. What the? Did he active gift somebody on standby? That was weird. That's interesting. I have you. Soldiers might have a, an interesting use. Look at this team. They're gonna do great. Yeah, look at this. They cooking. Party aid. I hope you are paying attention. Damn, we got knocked back quite a bit. Let devotion shine through. I understand. Dude, she the way she just flies in like that. 
We take even less damage. She was out here wave dashing. I hit B once and she was like, Shh. she was already back in. I've never seen a flying unit be so like a healer. A healer is like rushing down, bro. Nope. She tried to go first. She was like, I'm gonna accelerate. Nope. Looks like you froze. Nope. Accelerate. Accelerate these nuts. Ugh. Dude, we're looping her ass. Come, Faye. Ra Ra Ramona, Ramona, bring Ramona on. Oh, wait. She's always on her way. I'm pleased with this. Bruh, destroyed. Yeah, destroyed. <laughs> like, bro, we got like really good units. We have really solid units, but then again, like one bad matchup is like all it takes in this game to make it go really south. Illusory cloak, I hope it's good. We got some apples, some oranges. What the? Get cooked. They said, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> Yo, he just one, he just one shot that man. No, we gotta go. It's best if we leave. <laughs> okay, we got a illusory cloak. Activates before being attacked. Evade the next attack receipt. Phantom step, evade the this looks like it bypasses true strike. That might bypass uh evasive or true strike, hold up. Because if it costs two, and the way they worded it sounds different. Evade a single hit. If it's a multi-strike attack, I think. So if it's a multi-strike, you evade it. But I think you still got to buy it. You have to live or you, you still have to like kind of abide by how stupid. What's the word I'm looking for? You have to still abide by the true strike rules. Like, yeah, meteor gets ate up. Somebody would. Multi hit. Yeah. Rainy's. Humorous, humorous. Oh, wait, we did get her. I haven't been using her. What does she do? She's basically just another, um, oh, she's just another Oakley's. Maybe I remove Rolf. I wish there was a unit in this game with the name charlie but uh i think gilbert should work good enough Gil gilbert's angels but yeah you already knew what i was going for hold up this dude once again is getting removed from my team yo we got the angels Give her magic attack. Okay, which one's better? The magic attack or the phantom attack shit? This is like a phantom attack. You gotta, you gotta definitely mix it up a bit
Accelerate. Ah, radiant cover. Yeah, that's why I heard the witch's team pops off sometimes. Phantom Knight Shield. That's the case then. Maybe the bowl. Okay, maybe that aerial ability thing would pop off now. There's three people in that row, so what what's the they get critical hit and what else? Yeah, fuck this. So we give this to somebody else. So there's an aerial aerial alignment. Here we go. So this is an aerial assist for aerial units. Critical hit rate, accuracy, and then attack. Yup. Front row. One of them should at least indeed be covering somebody. So either I give her quick cover, cover an ally with a medium guard. Back row. Attacking before being hit at, uh, after an enemy attacks with an active skill. Wasn't there an accessory that we just recently got? The glowing light grants all allies accuracy and immunity to blindness. All allies, huh? Immunity to blindness. Seems kind of stupid, but I mean, that's our, kind of our counter too. Either I give it to somebody else or give it to someone here. Phantom Step, Phantom Step has to only be sp for specific fights because I can't really think of a use for using two PP. Grants the user plus one AP at night. If that was one, that'd be different. Also, we just recently bought Ruby and Sapphire shit, right? I'll probably just give her Sapphire since she wants to be more of a uh, support unit anyway. A support front front unit. Prioritize scouts. User is buffed and then prioritize scouts. Okay, so basically enemies present, scout, right? Scout enemies are present and then own condition would be users buffed. This skill will not activate otherwise. Hold on. Hold on, I think I... Okay, skill will not activate if there are no other, no applicable targets. 
I think I might have to change these two around, right? Or I think this won't work regardless. Wasn't there another one? So since we are going to be fighting a lot more other um, units, I think there is another aerial buff that we can give them, but I doubt it. Damn. I feel really bad, but there's like an aerial shift. He gets more PP too. Grants plus 20 attack and critical rate to flying allies. Who is that? Is that Liza? Bolt, yeah. More PP is better than nothing. Thirty-two party aid rapid order. Aerial alignment. Notos. He's got the Noto sword. You have the the other one. Initiative is high for you. Aerial pursuit activates after a uh, flying ally attacks. Oh my lord! Is that because you, is that tied to her ability or is that tied to her just being this class? Yeah, aerial pursuit is actually kind of good. Damn, she needs more PP as well, man. Damn, this whole unit needs more PP. Wire shield. Is there another shield that gives PP in covers? Nah, I don't think so. Aerial pursue. Running blind. Running shining light. Activities before an enemy uses an attack skill. It sucks because yeah, you need PP. She needs PP, dude. Like evasion is great and all, but you need PP. This fucking sucks. Sucking fucks. It fucking sucks. <laughs> See, he originally was supposed to be doing the sniping order to make sure they were hitting their attacks. Well, I did the, the, the back row. But now I don't think he really is necessary for this team. This team is basically. I might take the hold on. Yeah, you ain't got no use no more, boy. He was also banishing stab. Also, I had him in for the morale boost, so it's like I don't really think I need him in here no more. Honestly, Ramona's good on the other team, too, but. I might not even need Ramona for that team anymore. Extra heal. Why do you have extra? Oh. I guess technically that would want to be there. Cast his enemies present. HP regeneration to a role of uh, allies. Oh, I guess. Magic conversion is great. Especially when you're going against casters. This team really doesn't utilize her because they've been doing a lot. I might put her on that team and see what happens. 
but i think ramona was here just to help them yeah fuck that i'll leave that team alone i'm gonna see what this team does first so some of y'all needed some pp didn't y'all might be okay without the eagle eye or whatever pp veteran's eye patch Wait, aerial shift should only activate because it says buffer row allies, right? Front row? Or should I do not buffed? Activates after an ally is attacked with an active skill. Well, that might not even activate. So let's just say... This is a fucking weird skill to actually put on people. At the start of the battle, they get 20 crit rate and then more crit rate. So they should have like, if they have minimum 40 crit rate, they should just crit all the time. The buffer balance. Aerial shift doesn't work unless the enemy teams has flying allies, right? I think that's a weird thing. Because it says flying enemies present, right? That was the same thing with the other thing. So we could say, uh, front roll. I think right now I will give him something else. Tailwind, aerial pursuit, shining light. She's okay. There was another unit I was complaining about earlier, not having enough PP, right? Whose team was that? Because I want to give the hero's medallion to somebody. I think I already did it with him, right? Yeah, we already we already fixed him up. It may have just been somebody over here. Oh, that team was solid too. I think this team just needs to be a little bit solid as well. Jerome. Is Bryce on any team? Amali is not. So I, I guess I am just going to give him uh, this ability really quick. I, I think I'm going to just give him the, the Warriors Bangle, the Warriors Medallion. Or was it the Heroes Medallion? More PP, more EP. Over the uh, eye patch. Because I don't think he really needs crit right now. Shit, where is it? Here we go. I guess. Be behind. Something like that. All right, let's go beat some cheeks. It's 514 Guild Wars is back in session at six. So we got to get ready. You ready for them Guild Wars? Capture the enemy's command post. Clearly just get a flyer. They got 
even if we do the uh the blinding light on these assholes so they're good at counter attacks right and then them having refresh kind of sucks hmm how do you deal with a team like that? Fran? You can't counter attack if you did. To the sky. Honestly, Fran's team should just fucking wreck. <laughs> like I, I I literally couldn't think of another team. Uh Ramona's unit would probably be good here. Let's try Rainey's unit. By my divine bow. Have you need of my skill? Man, the these assists are kinda toxic. Which one has Liza? Shit. Depend Actually move one. these people back a little bit. I need, I need y'all to go back. One of y'all have to go back really quick. Better yet, better yet, just to, the, the prevent this from getting really sloppy really quick. Hey, y'all like, let me hit start. Restart stage. Restart stage. Since it was at the beginning, right? Bring out Liza's uh, team. Liza should be a part of... Team did I have her a part of? Yeah, Virginia's unit. You've made the right call. I won't disappoint. Smoke bolt. Yeah, and then if there was another unit in there, they get fucked too. So withdraw. Well while I'm gone. I'm hoping they don't undo the ability. By the way. Divine bow. Mm. To the skies. Yeah, Rainy's team is gonna have to play defense really quick. At once. Actually, no I should just fall. see now that they're like smoke bombed. I think I just go for the the W. Sir. No mercy. I shall rain arrows upon them. Shall I assist you? They take less damage there. So their next turn, they should like clap cheeks if they decide to attack. At once. They can't get no assist. Nothing. I shall rain arrows upon them. Shall I assist you? Eighty-nine. I don't think we die. Nobody dies there. Oh, yeah, he dies. Oh, I got pushed back into the other enemy, which is kind of whatever. Bruh, it's at 43. Nowhere is too far. All right, who's got an assist out here? I guess this asshole's an assist technically. Sir. You're nothing. I shall rain arrows upon them. Alright. One HP ain't shit. My griffin needs a rest. I stand ready. We just wanna go ahead and eat some nuts. Nowhere is too far. Okay then. Stand ready. Mm -hmm. Okay, so this shouldn't even be that hard of a thing. I'm just gonna go ahead and uh revival. Or better yet, maybe just have her pull up. As you've ordained. I'm in their firing range. Ooh, I <sighs> Yeah, that 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 they can still use that even though. My 
body aches. Alright, dog, you got me. You got me. You got me. But I also got you. Don't worry about me, dog. You dead next. Understood. Hold up. My wings shall take me. Departing at once. I think I just want to murder them all now. I think I'm murdering them all now. I stand ready. You like throwing you like throwing arrows, right? Nowhere is too far, sir. You like you like healing people, right? My skill, as you've ordained. No mercy. Shall I assist you? My wings shall take me. Departing at once. I stand ready. I got this. My quarry never eludes me. Gray sky. I saw on wings of white. Our ascendancy draws nearer. Pass down your mandate. At your service. Have you need of my skill? I make haste. My quarry. Quite the challenge. I've no allowance for mercy. 31, huh? Yeah, they just straight up killed one person. Fly ever true. All right, I gotta hurry up and turn around and do an attack. Arrows upon them. I have to catch my breath. What is he trying to do? The team leader, I think. Distant heal, delay, summon, summon. I shall never abandon hope. Well, whatever he's doing, I think is a heal, right? Negating that one is battle weight time. Okay, valor skills. I stand ready. Hold up. Do we need resurrection on somebody? Fuck I'm it. Restored. We'll deal with whatever bullshit. Departing at once. Oh, okay. My quarry never eludes me. Lend me your Attack accuracy crit rate uh fly Same ah. shot huh in my sight Oh light Psych Psych <laughs> Damn That was Oclees Oclees has her uh home slash now Nope Bastard cross these nuts boom pee 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 pee, pee down This should hold him. Oh, she held on to her AP? What was that about? Phantom attack. Oh, okay. Oh, uh, first of all. I didn't realize she was just not doing anything. Uh, Phantom Attack. I would say Shield Smite at least. She's probably going to want to do... Phantom Attack only when they have PP. One or more BP. There we go. Ranged attack. Yeah, Shield Smite should just be like whatever. Because at that point, she's really only here to just catch people slipping. I could. Oh, somebody can get a Ruby. I'm not giving her a Ruby, dude. Somebody else could use a ruby here. Fuck it. I'm, I'll give you a ruby. It'll be the least of my worries. My wings shall take me, as you've ordained. There we go. Game over. I saw on wings of white. This is it. This should hold. Me. Blessed winds. Wait. Why is it two PP down? Witness my. 
in my Damn, Phantom Attack is actually gone. That's what we needed, I guess. <laughs> this dude crying. Keep getting sharper. He's like, Ew. no father. All right. So, one thing I know I want to change is we got to have at least one of them angels be magic attack at all times. And I don't know when, whenever there's a, I guess, person in the back, that's a problem. It's negative two PP if the unit is grounded. Ah, that makes sense. I think we should definitely have her utilize that. Feather staffs, huh? Now, feather staffs ain't got nothing against us, man. At least nothing against Elaine. Battle for a roast fert. Althus Herd. Battle for Roastford. Alright, so this should be another relic. What the flippity flip flank fliggle? Brother. They got mad units out here. Angels for days. Liza, please. You've made the right call. I won't disappoint. That's probably the best thing I could do for now. And then take out the one assist dude right there using a flyer or something. Alright, so bow and arrows. Uh Yana's unit, huh? Now since he has earthquake, she's not gonna do well here. So Rainy's unit. By my divine book, pass down your mandate. Yeah, we're not going anywhere. Depart they should be once. able to do something here. I've no allowance for mercy. Dude, just one. One one switch is probably all we really need to make happen. Twenty-three. They get the kill, even with her in the back. I feel like the issue is, yeah, I don't like having to use these, but yeah, I'm not going to use it. I'm just going to take the damage and just heal. I hope Scarlet sees this. My wounds sting. Negligence, shall spell certain doom. As you've ordained. We'll be all right. Don't stand it. Shall I assist you? Nice. Shut them down. I shall never abandon hope. Okay. What what is our RNG look like for right now? Dude, I bet you they have javelin. Yep. 27. So if anybody needs to be saving their PP. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm win this. Oh my god, you gotta be kidding me with that. I have little hope left. Uh, life aid, these nuts. So, shining light. I think I'm just. Okay, what did I have right there? I think I had the, the assist, right?
All right, so I was trying to get rid of the hero's medallion. Give her the hero's medallion. Royal scarf. Or the dove plume. Yeah, so let's give her the hero's medallion. So we can actually give her enough PP to do shining light twice. I literally don't think I needed to do that, but no, we get cooked. Okay, it's probably the row shots and shit. Okay. So if I just do a switcheroo. There it is. Switch it up a bit. said I only took seven damage. Why did he lie like that? Is this somebody that heals? This should hold fly. Nice. My aim shall never fail me. Our ascendancy draws nearer. Negligence shall spell certain doom. Departing at once. These lands are ours. I shall never abandon hope. So about this, how do I get my whole team up here? Well, I got nine items remaining, but man, I don't feel like reviving them all like that. Oh, actually only one person died. All right, we're running back. I saw on wings of white. We're doing more damage in the back. Wait, so why is this prioritizing? Oh yeah, they get rid of their, um... Okay. Attack two enemies, refresh, uh, inflicts. What? Yeah, I didn't realize this. I would say roll with two combatants. Okay. It looks passive seal during a day. Physical defense down, right? Okay, basically when her AP is four or more. When HP is four or more. Sync shot is a physical. I guess they're just over healing. They're out healing what he what what we're able to do. They're doing row heal. Okay. Um, 
I would say if healers are available, who am I taking out? The issue here is we're probably not taking out anybody. And we got people who can heal in front lines, right? So what we would want to do is more than likely have growth change. Prince all allies. Row shot. He better be dual shotting. Bruh. Okay. I see what happens. Uh, okay. So definitely prioritize this. Two more enemies. Bro with three plus combatants. Well, actually, I would want to do this, right? But if I tell it to say no cow, no cavalry enemies present, will it actually? There we go. It'll actually go to the next thing, which is dual shot. So the people in the back definitely getting shot. I would say don't do this. Uh, how do you say ill if the combatant is debuffed like by de uh defensive debuff? How about I just do this instead? Yeah. We want her to do physical attacks whenever he's able to do it. This sucks because Okay, I guess what I could do here is scout enemies. Instead of saying scout enemies present, I could say scout and then user is buffed. But we'd also want to use home slash if she's buffed. Like, since we're not using accelerate, we can just do home slash. User is buffed, and the other enemy is debuffed. That is that like not a good idea? Apparently it's not. What's what's a better idea? The shield smite because I guess we're causing even more defensive down. Physical defense and then defense down. Oh, interesting. Oh, I think I need to set that to not deep or not debuffed. Okay. But like he could also be doing more. But I think what I'll do is just give him. Yes, I give him his uh, iPad back. Fuck it. This is it. Arrow of light. Allow me to mend your wounds. The end is not. Damn. Good. Bolster your defenses. Stop and steal. This should hold 
Put you down. Here we go. Fly. They don't get to do no damage to us. Pierce clean through. Alrighty. Like these traps and shit are kind of whack. Have you need of my skill? We definitely got to come over here really quick. As you've ordained, my wings shall take me, departing at once. I've no allowance for mercy. Ninety-nine, I guess. Permit me. Ugh. Have you needed Just use a fucking grilled steak. I don't give a fuck. Pass down your mandate. I make haste. Virginia should be fine. Kneel before me. Nope. And they not getting past her at that point. I saw on wings of white. Greater strength. Nice level up. Level up, level up. My wings shall take level up. Departing at once. All right, this is all of. Ooh, you son of a bitch! They got them noble strike ass wipes. Let me stop them a few. Stop a few of them. This is it is what it is. It is what it is, EXE. You dare challenge me. Damn, they got wiped. Is anyone surprised? No, not really. Even should it cost me my life. Nah, bruh. We probably don't even need old Cleese alive. Okay, maybe we do. Bruh, there it is. How did they get away from the first strike shit? Hasten strike. Yep. Bodied. In my everything this should hold get these fucking idiots out of here break their kneecaps my bow is my strength my arrows fly ever true have you need of my skill departing at once you know this is actually badass because you know what If I can move forward a little bit. Is that all? What is it? I think that's all all I needed. Damn. I won't Come on, man. I claim it in the name of the liberation. Watch what royalty can do. Blade wave. Come on. That's cap. A paltry effort. Kneel before me. I shall rain arrows upon them. Significantly lowered, but whatever. None of you will die here. Perry. <laughs> Maiden hammer, that's what I want to see. If only there was something like that for her where she can just Damn. Bruh. Yeah, Virginia's a fucking problem. She's not even got her undying will yet. I won't disappoint. Yeah. Just cleave the way for her to victory. Get it. I'm about to start doing this. Get 
get the enemy's like attack fortress, take it and park Oclesis team or uh, park a arc archer team on it, and then let my people start moving forward. Because holy shit! I have my limits, you know. I won't disappoint. Rest. What is it? And then basically gold hourglass, because we got so many of them. Watch what royalty. <clears throat> Kneel before me. At this point, there's literally no reason for me not to do this one specific thing that I should have just did a long time ago. Liquid fortune. And I'm also gonna give her the silver goblet. Who else is low level here? Rookie egg. Watch what royalty can do. I'm off. You don't stand a chance. How much EXP is this? Nice, 10k. Straight up 10k, bruh. What is it? Now bring up them reinforcements. I need some more fodder. I need a little bit more fodder. Challenge me. We take about 73. That's not bad. The fruits of diligence are sweet indeed. About another 10k. What is it? My wings shall take me. Uh, we still wouldn't. Actually, yeah, we would. Ah, oh, fuck it. Watch what royalty can do. All right. Have you need of my skill? Yeah, it looks like they need y'all over there. I fear I'm no match. So it has everything to do with where y'all, you guys are. 50, 65, 82. 152 humorous kind of humorous 68 home slash how the fuck I right, listen I'm not gonna complain I just want to see what the fuck happens here Okay. Witness my strength. Yeah, she. Her not being in the front row makes a, a lot of sense, but you want her in the front row so Rose can buff all the angels. Definitely ain't going as fast as we like, no but I think father. we we cleared some of the backline, didn't we? Nope. What is it? Damn. All right, we need we need some magic or something. We don't even need magic. We just yo, know, they have really good magic defense too. What the fuck? Damn, these dudes have good magic defense and good physical. And they have feather bows in the back, so I have to have a bow user. Of some kind doing something. Pass down your mandate. My wings shall take me. Alright, here we go. So the angel wait, the angel is a leader, right? Hold Pass up. Down mandate as you've ordained time yet there's a claim. flying it's a flying target so arrow range should fuck you up even if you take 50 percent less it's like you you taking like 30 or 40 here 20 all right have you need of my skill departing at once hateration bro i've no allowance for mercy oh, oh you shouldn't be up there but she should 
We, we're not appreciating this right now. Damn, Rolf walks into the fucking the 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 fucking wrong timeline and almost dies for it. Make that make sense. Bruh. I just want somebody in the back to die, right? There's no cavalry here, right? So, roll shot. You know what? Fuck this. What am I doing? Y'all finna get cooked. Just realize it's blindness that's really giving us a lot of, uh, giving us the work right now. Like evasion is lovely, but being able to hit my fucking target is a lot better. But I don't think that's what's causing us problems right now. Oh, it's these follow-up jackasses. I mean, we don't take any damage from there, but... 92. Okay, Unify has a Valor skill that boosts assist attacks. Man, them getting their heels at the start is kind of. I wonder if I can just have him follow up on people in the back row. Like, can his assist, his pursuit shit only trigger when they're attacking somebody in the back line? Because that's what I would want at this point. Yeah, Hone Slash is like not really doing shit, homie. Alright, we got the back line. And yeah, this team is finna do work. Fuck this. I saw on wings of white. Okay, pursuit. Back row. Turn it off. Excuse me. Yeah, his pursuit works here. Works pretty good. And prioritizing back rows, like whatever. Eagle Eye is like okay. Uh, Rainies. Here it is. God damn. Hold on. Hasten to heal. I'm gonna need whatever y'all got for that. In my I've had enough. Nah, darkness immunity, bitch. I feel like the person who I feel like there should just be two people in the back with blindness immunity triggering both blind skills. So we need the fastest people in the back. And I feel like that's what just happened. Having the fastest people in the back with blind immunity might be like the best thing to do. My bow is my just to bait, just to bait the blinding lights. Our ascendancy draws nearer. Get that shit out of here. Blinding light. Blinding light. Blinding light. We want to blind you with the light. I've only been playing for three hours. Feels like I've been playing all day. 
fucking weird, man. No, I think it's just a menuing, man. Minion's got me fucked up out here. Do let me know if you require assistance. May the Father bless you. Remove all buffs from all enemies. Hmm. Well, that, that's truly liberating, all right. May the Father bless you. <clears throat> okay, anybody who can... Magic. If you're a magic person, you can do that. That's good. Moves all buffs from all enemies. Yeah, that's pretty good. So, I think what we're going to do... Yeah, everyone's in town grateful, man. Yeah, dude. Yeah, dude. Thanks for being so grateful, dude. New map location. Holy brooch. Block an enemy attack with a medium guard prevents debuffs. Mm. That's a. Uh... Hmm. That looks really good, actually. That's what. Oh, that's what. Um. That's what that idiot has. Joseph, Joseph has that block an attack and get deep. Hmm, honestly, good. I might get these lapis pendants. That right is whatever to me right now, since I can farm it for free somewhere else. I don't know what the 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 play is, but I feel like. This is actually going to be good for me, especially since I think it could uh, be equipped to somebody else. Could it be equipped to like someone like him? I don't think so. It looks like it's a. Uh... Oh, no, it is. That is actually a good weapon or a good like armor thing. Block an enemy attack with a medium guard prevents debuffs pretty good actually the battle for cherry wall I just said effort and did make uh made some giga chat team so I don't have to change stuff around every five seconds I I ax Absolutely understand that. The best Giga Chad team you could ever ask for, right here. You've made the right call. Elaine is the goat. To me. This is this is a very confusing game. Your villainy ends here. I'm not exactly sure why they just put the the main dude right there. I feel like that we should have been on the other side. It was so easy. What the fuck? I wonder if it's because we had came from the other side. I feel like that map was easier simply because we had already um, traversed here from both east and west coast. So we could just pick the uh, most advantageous area. assistance oh okay look at this battle line standard activates at the start of a battle 
grants a roll of buffs based on the number of armored targets. Okay, grants guard rate, grants stun immunity, grants 20% defense. That could be really good. Magic burst activates after an enemy attacks with an active skill. Counterattack all enemies with magic. Inflicts initiative minus 10. Hmm. That's pretty interesting. I hope you found everything you Maybe I'll just buy it just for the shits and giggles. May the Father bless you. How much money can I make here? You may repurchase it, but only until you vacate the shop. You this dude said, as soon as you leave, that's your ass, Mr. Postman. You're not going to be able to buy this again. Man, fuck this. Stop picking up resources, man. You don't fucking need this shit. Apparently, that's where I need to go for the main quest. The outskirts of Burberry. I guess I go to this town first? Ooh. There it is, the battle for Shroud Ford. Yeah, yeah, whatever you say, lady. Wall City of Paston. Damn, buff ass. Your banners do not fly Zenoiran colors. And I oh, he said you, you ain't got the colors on, bro. Red are you dead? Red are you dead, bro? You creep out here. My name is Elaine, and we march with the Liberation Army. Our fight is one to free the peoples of this land and wrest our home from Zenoira's tyrannical clutches. This fairy or this angel really came out here and said, what set you rep? You ought not have any quarrel with us. Please <laughs> stand by our side in the battles to come. Your identities are made plain then. But it appears there's been a misunderstanding. Albion has ceded its lands to our new emperor, Galerius. You stand on Zenoiran territory now, and not a soul among us desires liberation. <laughs> How can that be? Sir Elaine, if you truly seek no quarrel with us, then leave this place. I will claim I saw nothing. But no, when next your gauntlets rap at our gates, you'll find neither mercy nor hesitation. Now, be gone. Our scout has returned, your highness. It would seem conditions in the city are less than ideal. It's my boy Clive. Forget about valuables. The houses I saw barely had any food. These people are doing all they can just to scrape by. Heavy taxation has left the populace with scarcely enough to eat, let alone stock their larders. And those who succumb to hunger or cold are left in the mud to await their inevitable ends. They crave freedom. Desperately so. Quite the contradiction, given the words of that night earlier. And yet, he didn't seem to be one for deceit. Not without reason, perhaps. 
But it's possible we lack the full scope of the situation. Indeed. In any case, we cannot overlook the plight of these people. Come, we march at once. That sure was a great cutscene. Man, I totally didn't go to the bathroom in between that time that cutscene was playing. <laughs> hey, I totally knew what was going on, bro. Oh, uh, this is such a weird dude. These battles are mad short ish of course you got somebody on the tower in the back yep Liza's just gonna come out with Virginia you've made the right call watch what royalty can do legit gonna blade wave these assholes not even gonna do that I'm just gonna smoke bolt dude all the way in the back That way. Battle wait time. I won't disappoint. I'm off. Wait, is that how? Wait, he got rid of his debuff like that? Really? No, no, he didn't. What is it? Okay, deploy. Friends unit. To the skies. At your service. He better not get blown up by some random shit. By the way. Understood. You're nothing. You don't. No mercy. Nowhere is oh, they get to the negate that, huh? Sir, at your service. Yeah, y'all still getting cooked. And of course, there's assassins in the bushes. Of course, why wouldn't there be? I stand ready. At what? Best be careful. Uh, they get the first strike and still get fucked. That is just a that is lovely. They thought they was doing something. Look at this. They came from the back. Like, no. What are y'all doing, bro? Dude, they not fucking with us. This is crazy. Nope. Nope. Wasted all that. Ugh, evade. Evade these nuts, bro. Ugh. That shit is a true strike. They get fucked up. I shall ease your pain. This will be easy. She has all that extra PP over there. With all the might of I think the I know who to give the AP gift to. What does she have on before? I really don't know what I had on Monica before I gave her the rookie, uh, the rookie egg. But I think what I might give her here is the the passive gift ability. My own AP or PP. There's three or more. She has ways to recover her own PP, which is great.
Y'all done or y'all finished? Sir, I yeah. stand ready. Let's go ahead and eat this uh, liquid food. No, you know what? Fuck it. Let's make sure we kill. Actually, that's not going to matter. And now that I think about it, that doesn't matter because it's based on HP. Actually, hold up. Increases damage dealt by the user's unit by 30% for one battle. Hold the phone here. I wonder if it also increases. It says damage dealt, but the damage dealt is based off of HP and Caden crit. So if it, I wonder if it like does a weird multiplier on the HP. Yep. Yep. 136. Yeah. Oh my god, the item works. It buffs the damage she does. What? Bruh, what? Cause she should only be doing half of 209. She should only do half of 209, dude. Half of 133 is not 86, bro. That actually multiplies the damage she does from Fatal. Um... So Empowering Drought probably will let you like one shot certain units if you, you deal it, if you do it, uh, you do the combo right. Damn, that's kind of crazy. Nowhere is too far. So damage dealt by 30%. So that's a multiplier on all the damage. That's fucking insane. So empowering drought is actually busted. Okay, so what we need is just like some nuts. I stand ready. Okay, maybe we're gonna eat another piece of nut. Technically, instead of a nut, I should have just ate an empowering drought. Bro, I guess they were just no missing. That's fire. all. I'm in their firing range. Oh my gosh. I stand ready. You know what? Y'all like doing that shit, so we're not dealing with that. Too far at once. We're simply not dealing with that. Okay. They said, "Wait, wait a second, nah, bro. I got this hourglass. And does it look half empty?" Or half full to you. <laughs> I, mean, I don't know, man. Yeah, it don't matter because I already won. We're not finna debate this. Guess right, you keep your life. Guess wrong, you die. Stardust Hourglass. I think I have more Stardust Hourglass than regular hour Hourglasses now. Do let me know if you require assistance. Attack a single enemy, inflicts poison, 50 potency and critical hit versus poison target. Enduring Guard. Lock an enemy attack with a heavy guard. Press the user a buff to endure one lethal blow. I don't even feel like buying anything. It was like a waste. Oh, we need the goat milk though. I need three goat milks to um, fully build. Um, this is like a town with a ship that I need to give goat milks to, I believe. There's too many text prompts in this game. All right, which was it? It might have been an area next to. Might have just been like a regular town then. Maybe this one. Mm. 
Yep. Good money, good money. Platinum ore. Yep. All right, here we go. So the tavern should get unlocked here. Yep. Bodied. 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 Okay, so sturdy limber. None of this shit is important right now. I'm gonna try to do one more map. And then we're gonna switch over to Grand Blue, find a setup, and then I'm gonna end the stream. Damn, this is actually a shorter stream than normal. Damn, that's kind of crazy. Not a fan of that. Not a fan of that at all. I'm sorry. The battle for pasting. Gotta grind Guild War, yeah. I mean, I would focus on like just getting enough done to where you can get some power ups and some upgrades for your grid. And then I think you'll be all right. All right, y'all got any assist out here? You've made the right call. I won't disappoint. Oh, of course, of course. Watch what royalty can do. I'm going to. have Fran or actually let's have Dinah come out yeah Dinah comes out and yeah, this team could be better team definitely has some weird matchups here shallow pursuit like ew. we'll call him Actually, I can take that last ruby I just put on the roof. It wasn't. It wasn't the Hilda has a ruby. Oh hell no! Nah. Yeah. I don't know why Hilda still had anything, considering her status in this playthrough. I'm listening. Jump to an ally enemy. What is it? This might be reckless as hell, but I won't disappoint. Okay, withdraw. Fight well while yeah. I'm gone. I'll be there before I'm listening. I have you covered. Okay, jump. Immediately jump to the boss. Ski speed run. Speed run the fucker. Okay, so they have mirror shields and shit, so like... One, two, three. One, two, three. I feel like these two behind each other make sense. Oof. Okay, let's see what else we can get ourselves into here. Well, let's just use a bunch of items. Yeah, we got to find a good RNG, right? Oh, give that man some more PP. I just realized he has the miser bracelet on, which is okay. 
But we don't want him with that no more. He a grown man, bro. Take that bullshit off. Okay, I guess I gave away all my blind cures. Phantom step. Oh, we ain't got access to that no more. Activates after using an active skill. Wide pursuit. Tell you what, just give this, take that off. We just want to take that off for sure. I think his best bet is to just get some get some more HP, I suppose. 93, 175. 175. We're looking for the RNG here. We're looking for the RNG. Where is it? Where is it? 93. We're not dead. 81. 81. We'll take less damage by going in the back there. 54. 123. 69. Maybe if the two thieves go in the back. No. Let me see. You also have something free to do. Let's do this. First action. Immunity to blindness. I don't think that's really necessary here. Yeah, they just have some bullshit. Um, I think there's some abilities to just take out flyers, right? That's a first action. Eighty four piercing lance. Okay, that's looking a lot smarter, to be honest. Take an action. Penetrate. Fuck this shit. Shattering pursuit. Follow up. Uh huh. That's interesting. I think we're good. Honestly, I think I just need to take the 31 and just call it a call it a, a done deal. Continue your heedless march into Albion lands, and I shall stand against you at every turn. Damn. Careful. Tis yours now. Charge. Really, they all just activate mirror weakness. Wow, this is truly uh Lay down. truly some toxicity. <laughs> this is truly some toxicity right here, bro. Good thing we have immunity. Bro, the fact that they keep giving getting PP and shit, dude, is fucking obnoxious. And as long as that death span is going, if I turn off the eye of 
If I turn off that ability, we should be okay. Not looking great. Careful now. Guard seal. I shall bear a chance. Misstep. Bruh, dude. This team is mad toxic. Holy shit. It's like nightmare level 200 toxicity right there. I'm listening. All right, I need somebody. Ooh. Yeah. Either we win or we lose. And uh, the way it's looking right now, we might be losing. Come on. We we came over here to speed run this, but uh, may yeah. have been the the wrong choice. Also, um. I would say hmm, nocturnal evade would be pretty good evade a single hit nocturnal evade should allow you to just keep procking the, uh, the attack I think but since it's a single hit it doesn't matter Mm-hmm. This is where I think using this is gonna come in handy. Shut that shit down immediately. 141. I had the yeah, this one right here act inflicts attack 20% and initiative on all enemies. Yeah, and yeah, turn that off and see what happens. Highest initiative. Who has the highest initiative? Dude in the front has 30, right? Being able to stun them all is great. See, this is where we st we gotta start stealing PP or something, man. Glowing light ain't shit. We want passive steel. Still in there, passive shit, they don't seem to matter. Hold up. That secondary condition should not matter. Done. Done. Let's just say first action. Just to see. Front row, I guess. Fifty-two. We heal one hundred and eighty-four. All right, we do a good chunk of damage to these people at this point, which means one unit definitely gonna hurt. Let's go. Damn, weakness hunter. They all just countered. That shit was great. See, that's why you have to... If they steal, they can just keep stealing their PP that they magically get back. And then do nothing but follow-ups. Oh, dude, there's some crazy loops you can do. For gifting AP, stealing... Or stealing... Stealing... Um, PP and whatnot. This dude still did mirror weakness like five years later. But if you're blinded and try to do mirror weakness, you actually miss the attack. 
Can we please get one of them killed here? Ah, uh, whatever. Not looking great. You so hurt. Not looking great. Most obnoxious group of fucking art knock knockers, bro. Oh wow, it bounced me off the door to immediately fight him again. That was wild. Wow, dude, the tech though. The tech bounced off the dude, the bounce off the door to go straight for his ass again. Holy shit. The fu the funny part about this is they get the first strike, but it don't matter. Where are you looking? My end approaches. Nocturnal evade. Get past me. Goodbye. If they are blinded, they can't mirror it. The mirror cannot actually land it. So, so to beat these people, you need blind. You need to blind them before they um, mirror the weakness. Oh, they're dead. They're definitely dead. Bastards. Y'all really try to stop some beast? You see how high she was jumping, bro? She jumped in your goddamn house. She just jumped literally through the chimney, came down the chimney, started beating everybody's ass. Show of strength, sir. That's what happens. This shit was fun, dude. Why did you lie to us? Your people surely seek respite from the suffering of Zenoiran rule. You have the wrong of it. When the Empire came forth and began violating our land, I fought back with every ounce of my being. I was prepared to oppose their rule until our final soldier fell. As were my people. They stood by me and risked their very lives in defending this sacred ground. But six months passed, and then a year. The pain of a citizenry besieged grew fiercer and fiercer. And on that day, my own Ooh, kidnapped his son. That's horrible. Yet it only worsened from there. Damn, B. Sound like a personal problem. Anyway, we see we're here to save you in the world. Damn. By Zenoiran orders, they massacred my child and offered his corpse as a sacrifice to our new masters. Oops. I was well prepared to follow him beyond the veil of death, but Zenoira had no interest in executing me. They chose to leave me in power to exploit my rage and my despair for their own nefarious purposes. So, I bent to the will of my people, and the path they chose to walk was that of subjugation. Okay. Let's go. You might not realize this, but we've met before. Years ago, when I was just a young girl, your son and I were quite close, in fact. Random facts that you would only get if you paid attention to the story that would randomly drop it at times you... As for like, you. I remember a man of great integrity. Yeah, this game story could have been played out better. I, I think going from like 
the way they just dealt with the story in this game is unfortunate because you come from 13 sentinels that 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 plot was really good the the plot was good even though you could like go from random stories or whatever and ruin certain twists it was still enjoyable like you could like go through each one of the the characters perspectives in this game you could just go through whatever like continent but there's like i don't know it just it feels so disjointed dude like it was off the rails like yeah i could have just focused on pistorius first and then focused on something else and then focused on the other thing but it was just it still feels kind of weird the way these cutscenes just play out and though we were too young to understand much of it you spoke often of the true makings of a lord of the love such a role requires yes i recognize my you backstory now. is this that and the third feel bad for me so you recruit me so much since we I do battle and then you hear a sad story oh man should i execute him joseph <sighs> if i was the leader that's what i would do but uh hey it's you you do whatever you want that's exactly what just goes on like every time there's some kind of like battle and there's a unique character they tell you their backstory after whooping their ass and then it's recruit or kill the time has finally come the formula to see my son watch over his passing or rescue him of course rescue him Not while you can still honor his memory if you would scarlet This jointed story. And then again, it would have been way too much effort for them to legitimately write all the lines for all the different all, like routes. Like if you recruited this character and came all the way here first and then went back here, they're not gonna sit there and let like pretty much have all these characters from these different uh, countries. I have all this different dialogue. Ah, feather shields are defensive oriented warriors that are highly resistant to magic attacks. Yes, the ones from the Coliseums that actually, that was the one unit in the Coliseum that prevented me from like proceeding for like six or seven hours. That 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 guy we just got is a mirror, uh, mirror folk or a mirror shield person, right? Where is it? Well, he'll be on the last on the list. Broken eyes, reflect magic. Enemies passive skills set to activate before or after an attack will not activate. Grants the user 2 PP. This is stupid. This is stupid. Reflect the magic attack, right? Mirror weakness removes the user's debuffs inflicted all inflicts all removed debuffs on the target. But could you couldn't you like purposely debuff them and then once wait, couldn't you technically do that? Couldn't you purposely debuff this user with like one of those weak debuffs and then once they actually attempt to debuff them with something, he'll actually activate mirror weakness? Hmm. Like with the light resistance, yeah. If he's the only one attacking, right? Impulse. Oh, why wow, we have two Phantom Knight shields, though? Dude's magic defense is OD. Can't reflect magic attacks from foes such as wizards.
Mirror Ring grants an allied unit the same buffs as the user. I think that means like certain buffs you get from Valor skills and shit, right? See, my thing is, couldn't you just put that on him and then, like, for the rest of the match, just have him as someone who can instill buffs? Ah, so what I would do, he could just be a battery of some sort. Granted, the same buffs as the user. Because this is a Valor skill, right? So like any uh, battlefield, like a uh, like light feather buff, right? I guess can get mirrored. Yeah, this dude is OD. He's probably the ultimate unit of the game. Impulse, attack a single enemy, flicks magic defense. Minus 50, Mystic Shield, grants the user two plus PP. Extends, uh, grants allies in the user row 50% magic defense extends to all allies during the day. Damn. This unit is really good. The question is, what do you do to make him really busted? He's already busted. How do you bet? Uh, how do you bust them further? Mirror weakness only works if you're not. I guess you need to give him something with passive seal. You give him something with passive seal and then you give him blindness immunity and he's good to go. You don't want to give him debuff immunity because then it makes his mirror weakness pointless. I feel like that's... Wait a minute. If you have debuff immunity, hold up. If you have debuff immunity, can you keep? I know. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I don't know if this works. There's that weapon, the attack, right? Leaping slash grants the user plus one AP if the, if the attack is critical, right? Could you prevent yourself from being debuffed if you have the immunity to it? and just keep fucking leaping slash until they die i don't know if that works i don't think it works like that actually he'd actually be able to mirror that if, if there's like an enemy on the other team that like follows up with something Yeah, if they try to follow up with something, I think. Okay, hold on. Dancer's Delight. Mystic Shield. Yeah, this dude could be pretty good. My other team that I made ended up being a unit that takes zero damage, but does a fair amount back. We need the one immunity he needs is passive immunity. Because if he gets his passive shut down, it's GG. There should be like a passive and blindness immunity. Yeah, right there is good. So we can get a blindness immunity there on a weapon. I don't think there's any passive immunity uh, weapons. Yeah. Passive cure. If there was a blind is there a blindness yeah there might be something like that for this team i don't know 
But I do want to see something really quick. Activate before an ally is attacked. Press one life to cover an ally. Grants the user plus PP. Basically, three or more PP. Inflicts all remove the buffs on a target. This is going to be weird. I got to see this interaction. We got to definitely try something. Do let me know if you require assistance. Sapphire pendant. Nice. Follow up skills deal. Yeah, we know we got to get that. May the father bless you. Triple shatter. Attack three enemies. Wow. Inflicts physical attack down and magic attack down. Holy moly donut shop. That's a good ass item. May the father bless you. Sapphire, you know we got to get that. May the father bless you. <sighs> Once again, broke. Broke it in a joke. I need to uh, use a mock battle really quick. The one thing I want to see is if Dancer's Delight's uh, buffs gets canceled out. I need more goat milk. Imagine being Leia and not being promoted. Diligence pays dividends. Jelen, you might as well. What, am I, what else am I supposed to do with all these honors? Actually, I guess I could start like expanding my units, right? Basically, I didn't already drop this unit. Then they was they used to be the hottest unit on the block until I came about. I guess dancers delight. I would give him. So definitely debuff immunity. You wouldn't need this anymore. So more, more crit, I guess. What's the highest crit thing you can get? I guess you get blade dance. I'm trying to, I'm trying to just see an interaction. This isn't technically a setup for anything. I'm just trying to see one thing and test one thing. We just need a uh, blade dance. As soon as I can find that son of a bitch. It's too many abilities. There's no way I went past it like 13 times. Blade dance, blade dance. Golly. Crit rate. Crit rate plus 10. So 57, 2020. All right, 2020. That's an extra. Order. I will actually give them like. Probably. Keenness. I'll give them three of them. Just enough. Perfect.
Yep. So we want to see something really quick. I judge you. Witness me. Raise your shield. Pick right now. I'll never yield. Oh, okay, so it didn't didn't So the debuff is getting over okay, it gets overridden. Right. But what stacks is blade dance? Blade dance a hundred percent stacks. So I think what you would want to do. Blade Dance probably stacks up to five times, right? So if we do five of the Leaping Slash is going to remain there all day until like Reflect Magic like kicks in, right? Or Reflect Mirror Weakness. So I think what we do is get rid of this and give him the Sapphire Pin. He's going to want a lot of uh, PP. I say if there's three or more PP left. And I would say if there's somebody over here who would actually try to who I don't know, Goville. I would say not even that. Something that does like fucking a uh, debuff. He's 27. Oh, because of, dude, th that's actually fucked up. I guess I would need to have Grand Barris off. Yeah, Grand, ba yeah, because because the critical down still comes out you would still need to find something else for him something that gives him more crit maybe i don't know i would say we don't need to get super fancy physical defense huh There's nothing that gives uh okay there's nothing that gives you uh like pp or ap excuse me not yet at least leaping slash okay if this is gonna work two only ap is two or more Okay, this is a unit that could probably definitely take advantage of a whole bunch of shit because he's getting two he's getting an extra PP for every time he's covering an ally. So that means you can cover and then like probably use the PP to gain AP in some way. Reflect magic. I don't really care. I just want to see if this leaping slash shit would work. So like his initiative is faster, so Inflicts magic defense down. More resistance, leaping slash. I would say if your own AP is one or less. Own AP is two or less. Da -da 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 -da. So basically. After he's done doing his bullshit. 
I would say two or two or less. Mystic shield, and then only do this one is two or less. So basically, he should just if he's not fast enough, what should happen is, or if if it's set purposely or if it's set correctly, right? He would leaping slash, enemy would go next, trying to debuff him with some shit, uh, or even the angel would try to blind him, and then if it successfully or lands or something mirror weakness should activate right but blindness he doesn't want to have he doesn't want to uh, be blinded he just wants to be like deep off somehow right so he would just come out and just keep basically after he does the leaping slash his crit rate should already be high enough to land a crit rate to keep his leaping slot or keep his ap high and then the next turn the enemy goes or something and just does damage to him or some shit Unless this is another way to, to clear debuffs. Because I don't think you can clear this unique fucking 30 crit rate unless you do mirror weakness or like some specific like clear. Because like the, the leaping slash crit rate seems to be there indefinitely. Actually... Hold on, at that point, would you just do Eagle Eye? Since this motherfucker can get his 2 PP every time, right? He could just sacrifice and then uh, Eagle Strike, which grants True Strike and then um, a guaranteed crit, right? Ah! Uh, I, I think he could do something crazy. Hold up. Hodrick needs to have something to inflict like blind or not even blind just Ooh, we don't want rampage <laughs> no 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 Re getting froze also would suck inflict stun that would also suck <laughs> if it yo stun blind and um freeze fucks over the angels bruh is there not anything that isn't like something that staggers and fucks you over oh my god hodrick I guess this is just a attempt to see something. You should go first, leaping slash, do whatever. No harm shall be. What the fuck? Okay, I must have like unequipped him. He did impulse. Oh my dumb ass. Oh, I definitely fucked up. Yeah. I'm just going to reload this after this, but uh, just to emulate something. I don't know if he gets rid of uh, the 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 crit rate debuff he gets on himself. Have some your protect me. Witness me. Okay, I just realized he is uh, susceptible to get killed. Okay, so uh, wait a minute. Hold on, y'all doing teams, right? We gotta, we gotta get this boy uh, a healer. Get this man a healer, dude. He was getting cooked. Oof. 
refresh, quick kill, yada yada. Alright, so... He's a flyer, right? So I would have... See, this is where your boy... Yeah, he might be a part. He might be on the flying team at this point because you get a crit rate based on the number of flying targets, right? I would give him extra crit rate right there. Then aerial shifts. We're just supporting him. Okay. Still got more fight now. Is any spell like can make you attack twice or a double cast? You strike. I think there is. Tis yours now. A temporary fix. The heavens watch over me. Father above. All right, so now he should have 100% crit rate. Mirror weakness. Grant them sucker. Leaping slash. Oh no. He fucking. How did he not have a 100% crit rate? Okay, how many times did Blade activate? Blade. Blade Dan should have activ activated how many times? It activated at least twice, right? So is that activated that many times? Oh, this is not a cut. That didn't happen, did it? The start of battle. Okay, so you're given at the start of a fight, Grand C rule of allies based on the number of flying targets. Does aerial alignment not work either? Oh, it might not. Uh, yeah, I think this is a... Hold on, one more time. Let me see what happens. Uh-huh, critical rate up. He's at 50 right now. Tis your now. A temporary fix. Mystic shield. I feel like I should only mystic shield when his uh, PP is down by a certain amount. AP up. See, that was supposed to hit. So now he should get rid of his crit down. Every time Mirror Weakness comes out is what I'm thinking. I judge you. Okay. I shall never crumble. So tech well man, okay, so it's it looks like it works to an extent. It's just that if the enemy has no more actions, he can't keep he can't keep getting rid of his uh critical down or his critical rate minus shit right but i think a better use of this would be to just have a soldier with keen dance or whatever yeah a soldier just give you the 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 immediate thing and then what you could also do is sac like have them in the front front row i guess and then like sacrifice grants the user two plus pp cover them how much is AP gift? So after every two sacrifices, right? He can give himself fucking two PP, man. So what I would do. Two or more. I would probably just set something up like Mystic Shield, old PP. 
Yeah, fuck this. What am I doing? It's less than like two. One PP is three or less. We just do this. Yeah, we do have the uh, the Drake Ice Shield. We should. Freeze and stun immunity. Man's uh, physical defense is bad. Bad, bad. Oh, the guard efficiency is 50%. That's whatever, to be honest. It, it it is what it is. Anyway, I I think I'm done playing uh this game for right now. I'm about to move on to Guild Wars shit, so I don't get like left behind. I gotta go see and copy uh copy and paste some bullshit onto my Grand Blue. So everybody watching this on YouTube, I appreciate y'all for coming out. Thank you for the uh support. Thanks for the donations today. The donations were pretty good, and uh everybody on YouTube, I'll see y'all again tomorrow. Don't worry. And uh, we'll be back with more of this game. Hopefully to beat it. I know it was a shorter stream, but I started a little bit later than I wanted to. But uh, yeah, it was really fun. I think I'm just going to focus on beating this game after I figure out off camera, a good team to use with the feather dude. That the concept of just looping the leaping slash until somebody's dead, I think is going to take a lot of effort to find it's gonna take a hell of a lot of effort to, to, to figure that one out but um i will see y'all later